Hey guys, James and Mark here with another mukbang. If this is your guys' first time here on our stream, please hit that subscribe button and answer these three questions for us. Where are you from? What's your favorite food and how did you find us? My name is James and this is Mark and we film mukbangs every Monday and Friday at 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. <laughs> You're so good at that, like remembering when to use specific daylight savings time and standard time. I feel like I've talked about daylight savings time like the most in my life this year. Yeah, I think That's so. Just, um, so as you know, this has been a very long week for various reasons. Uh, we're still waiting the results of the election. I haven't checked it in like the last four hours, so I don't imagine anything's happened since. Yeah, I don't know. So, um, I think the last time we checked, uh, Biden was ahead in Pennsylvania, so we flipped that. Mm, right? Yes. But uh, this is a nice reprieve from consuming all of that news media. This is like going to be like our little break from all of that. So we're super excited to be sharing another first time recipe. I don't remember you ever making this no, dish. Never, we never made this at home. And so what are we making while I get this set we're up over here? We're going to make jajangmyeon. 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 Why did you say it like that? Don't. Jajangmyeon, <laughs> uh, <laughs> which is a uh, black bean noodle. Okay. So my first question is, when I think of black beans, I think of the alternative to pinto beans at Chipotle. Is it the same thing or is it different? I think it is. Oh, soy, it's no, it's soy beans. Soy it's totally soy different, right? Okay. I was getting black confused. because it has other like, ingredients. Uh, but we're making it uh, uh, from scratch on our own. Um, they do sell the jajang sauce pre-made um, mm. that you could just pour over noodles. Yes. So we didn't, but we're gonna make our own sauce. We're making our own sauce, which is a huge undertaking. I hope uh, we don't screw this up. But I'm sure it'll be perfect per usual. We'll see. Well, I. Um, I uh, uh, looked at a couple of videos of Manchi and other like Korean like chefs on mm -hmm. YouTube. So I don't know. I think I could do it. I mean, even the jar even tells you like the uh, instructions on how to make the sauce. Yeah. And so, like, if you never have had it, how would you describe? It's, what it even tastes like. You know what? It's one of those like comfort food. So it's not authentically Korean. Oh, it is. But it feels like it should be. It's a Korean take on a Chinese dish with a very similar name. Mm, yeah. Jajangmyeon. I don't know. I don't know how to say But uh, yeah, but we're going to make it the Korean style. And then I don't know. It's, it, it's, it, it's kind of savory. Mm. Um, the texture of the noodles just really fun to eat. Yeah, I I always feel like a bloated whale after eating jajangmyeon, oh, but it's fine. It's yeah. a definitely uh, is it comfort food category? To me, it's very much comfort. Yeah. Food. yeah, I do remember the first time Mark like tried to sell me on it. I never ate jajangmyeon growing up, so like looking at it, not like super appetizing, appetizing but such as black. Yeah, but then once you add like the so like, there's like pretty garnishes you could add that helps offset it, like chopped cucumber, oh, yeah. I think, and yeah. other little things. So then um, from there, then now I just look at the dish and I'm like, oh, it's beautiful. And then some so of our good. friends who never had it before, um, they were like super curious to try it because they've been watching Korean drama. Yeah. And they, there's always a scene when someone's eating uh, jajangmyeon. I, and and, and it's, it's always them eating more than I feel like they should put in their mouth. So maybe we'll try that later. Like, who can put the most noodles in their mouth at one time? Because Ooh. I think I would lose, though. Naturally, Mark is like the first time I ate lettuce wraps with him. I was just like, Are you, you, you have to be careful. You might eat your hand. You're not paying attention because you. Just I are. I have a small mouth. Like I can't open my mouth yeah. wide, but I have pouchy cheeks, so I it could it could really get stuck in there. <laughs> Like chipmunk, I can store food in my cheeks oh, for days. Oh, let's say hi to people. Yeah, let's get to that. Uh, hi, Emerita and Jamie, Lindsay, welcome all. Lisa, Matthew, Diana, Tom, Joshua, welcome. Michael, family is life. 
to Zhang. Thank TGIF. Yes, we agree. Love seeing everyone in the chat. Hey, Stray Cat. Fabulous. Yes, it's going to rain tomorrow. We're looking forward to it. Maybe we should eat something soupy tomorrow. Oh, good idea. Tom, um, what are you making for us tomorrow? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Noah Claymore. A Sam says, Oh, uh, hello, everyone. Says A Sam. <laughs> uh, hi, L and Vic. It's all welcome. L says, Nice haircut, Mark. Thank you. Melanie, glad that you could join us. And I'm glad we finally got the gift card to you. Right? Yeah, I'm, I'm glad that you're. <laughs> Hi, Cindy and Tina. Um, we haven't tried it with truffle oil. Oh, do it Hwasa style? That, that's Hwasa style, yeah. Hmm. That looks good, though. Um, even Hwasa style, she cooks it so that there's like no. Well, she uses the instant, so that's different, right? She uses the instant uh, japagetti. Hmm. And then she adds the raw egg and truffle oil to it. Yeah. We got Dwayne here. Welcome, everybody. Steph says, great end to a crazy week with all that is going on. I had to ask my wife, is this real life or are we in some insane simulation? You, you know what? Like after this year, I would not be surprised at that. This is all some kind is of. This is a long dream. <laughs> year, we're going to wake up. We're like, oh my gosh, we're sleeping so high. <laughs> Hi, Shelly and Rush Girl. Welcome to the stream. We got Angelina, who is probably very tired right now because they just got a puppy. Oh, that's so cute. But a lot of work, super a lot of work, yeah. And if we didn't get to you guys' comments, you know, we're gonna be here all night, so just drop it in there. We got Arlene from Vegas. There's been a lot of attention on Nevada the last couple of days. Clark County. Yes. Uh, Malisha B, welcome. Again, this is your first time here. Hit that subscribe button, like this video. Again, Friday, like goals work a little bit differently. We work in increments of 50. Every time we hit 50, we have to take a shot. And every time we get a super chat, we have to play a game where we may or may not have to take a shot. So that's how it works. And then towards, Friday, yeah. towards the end of the stream today, we're going to be playing um, our usual game. And we're just going to hang out for a little bit before Mark gets really busy in the kitchen. I think it's not going to be that bad. Because I did, so I mean, I bought an extra zucchini, onion, and potato for the thumbnail. Oh. But you already chopped them. Though. But I already chopped them. So there's going to be no chopping tonight because I already pre-chopped, so that should make things easier. Yeah. But should we kind of, oh, so we talked about this black bean sauce. Mm -hmm. uh, we're going to add a lot of pork meat because mm -hmm. that's pretty traditional. But we could elevate it by adding a uh, bunch of seafood. So we have some calamari, oh. shrimp, and scallops. That's excellent, right? Mm -hmm. Seafood is that's, uh, always delicious. And then we have uh, specifically uh, uh, jajangmyeon. Noodles. Noodles. Mm. So, um, but we'll cook the noodles off camera in another pot. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we got Russell and Paul watching us. They said uh, hello and we love you guys. Love, love you too. Thank you, you so much for dropping by and hanging out with us. And James Love just woke up. That's nice. <laughs> so, we're going to just be drinking the re remaining Vizzies that we have. I have a Hard seltzer, it's a strawberry kiwi. And then Mark has? I have a blueberry pomegranate. Ooh. Mm, cheers. You you need the antioxidants I today. Do. Oh. Mm -hmm. I'm recovering. Had a long day yesterday. Yeah. It was fun, though. It was a lot of fun. So Mark had a... Uh, event yesterday for his work. It was a dueling piano. So if any of you guys ever been to like a dueling pianos like type of event, let us know in the chat. But it was super fun. Well, one, uh, they had a pivot. Pivot is one of those 2020 buzzwords, but you guys had a pivot because historically they did it inside of a cute little like venue and then they had to transform their current facility out. They moved it outdoors. We wanted to do it outside for extra safety measures. Yeah. But we wanted it to be large enough where we could separate the tables now because again, safety is very important to us, but yeah. we still wanted to host our dueling pianos. So it kind of worked out. Did you like it? Oh, it, it totally worked out. Yeah. It was very cute. They invested in like some bistro lights mm -hmm. and lighting is everything. Like not only for like your home, but for like YouTube videos, for ambiance at events. So I think lights are severely underrated. <laughs> uh, 
I agree with you. I think we don't appreciate light. Let there be light. Yeah. Let there be light. And then you notice, like lately, because it's gotten dark early, that's affected my mood a little bit. Because I'm like around five o'clock, I'm like, I should not want to like start to go to bed yet. Like the night's just starting or evening. Yeah. Um. So it still says uh, she was close to buying these drinks, but I didn't. How are they? Please share. So I personally think they're a step above. What's the other one? Truly? White Claw? White Claw. White Claw. White Claw, I think, is like probably the least sweet. This is middle sweet. And then Truly is too sweet. So That's this like one, the range. Um, I think what makes it cool is that they actually use a little bit of real fruit, fruit? juice ah. to flavor it. Yeah. Um, and maybe that's why it tastes better. Yeah. But it's still only 100 calories. Like the fruit cart that James likes uh, by Golden Road, mm -hmm. that's really sweet. But then that's it's sweet. like, that's not meant to be a healthy, like, you know, two carb drink, you know, but, yeah. eat, but this is, this is only two carbs. Maybe we should check out what Tina suggests, Maha Organic Hard Seltzer. I don't think we've had that. I mean, yeah, I really don't. Maha. There's a lot now, huh? It's Even in Corona in makes some. Oh, the coronavirus. No, so <laughs> Corona makes some. They do. And Bud Light or Bud Light. Well, this is what happened. Um, was truly considered like the pioneer of all this business? White Claw. Oh, White Claw, sorry. So they did that initially, and then I felt like everyone was like, wow, we need to like hop on that bandwagon, so let's do a product line. Well, LaCroix and vodka mm -hmm. probably started the... Oh, you're right. I have, um, you know, the vodka with LaCroix, you know, yeah. those people that want to Is LaCroix even a thing still? I don't want to hear anyone ever talking about it these days. Oh. <gasps> we got a super chat. What does that say? Good job with the Dylan can. Tom and Sean, thank you for coming. I don't have preliminary numbers yet. Mm. Uh, only because uh, Alicia did ask for Friday off. Yeah. And I didn't want to bother her. Mm. But yeah, that's good. Usually she knows that I'm like wanting the preliminary numbers like right away the next day. But yeah, just, you know, I don't need to know right now. Well, that means we have to play the game. So this is a great uh, segue into that. So again, thank you, Tom and Sean, for that. Um, I do want to quickly add, I did sing at your event yesterday. And I have to thank our subs, because I think you guys have gotten me more confident to just sing in general. It was in front of like a group of 40 people-ish. Yeah, we have around 40 people. And Mark said I sound good. Oh, you were really good, but here's the thing. Oh, like, oh no, wait, what? No, before we went last night, like, you know, because, like, this is our third annual Dueling Pianos. Yeah. So the past two years, James did perform. So I just expected that he was going to perform again last night. And then so by when I asked him, he's like, no, I didn't even practice. And I said, the last two years I've been practicing. I know, but girl, like, Every Monday you sing. That's your practices. But I don't like know the words, and then I I like to integrate like choreography a little bit. So if like I was going in blind, I was choosing from like five different songs: Spice Girls, Wannabe, uh -huh. Natalie and Brulia, Torn, um, Destiny's Child, Say My Name. But then I didn't realize that was so fast. So I was like, I can't do these fast. Oh. So I kind of I defaulted to Backstreet Boys. I want it that way because I knew about ninety percent of the words, but. Yeah, Joshua's commenting on your haircut. Looks so good. Thank you. All right, would you like to go first? Sure. Now here's the remember the new rule: if you get a tie number, automatic loss. Right? That's what we recently implemented. So if you say five high low and it's a five again, you just lose. That's what we did um, recently. Really? You don't remember this at all? I re no, I remember if we land on a two or ace. You have to say black or red. Black or red. But, but then I think we also added, like, if you get the same exact number, that you just lose. Oh. We're just, basically, it's just to help you guys make sure that we drink. Okay? okay. So no, no wiggle room around this. Ready? First number, ace. So you have to guess black or red. Okay, at That's first, 50, 50, I know, but at first, anything is really 50-50 if you think about it. No. High-low, if you skew more one way, then there's less numbers. Okay, at first, I got so excited, but then, yeah, we're doing, uh, I'm going to do black. Black. 
So that is a new rule. Yeah, what's the chance of that happening? Actually, one. But one I want because it's black. Fine, fine. So that's the new rule then. If it's a red and black and it's tie, then the red and black take precedence. Oh my gosh! What? Okay, so then now you have to guess red or black again. Uh, I'll be. He has to get through five cards, by the way. Black, black, black. Okay, now tie low. Again. Low. Four. Hi. How cards? Hi. Oh, you survived. Oh, Very good job. Okay. What are the chances of that? I liked how we made up a rule that was in your favor on the spot. Well, because I don't know, like I technically won, even though it was a tie. I, okay, I I now know the answer. If it's uh Acer two, you know how we do black or red? Yeah. If it's another of um, the same of the same and same color then you automatically lose so if it, if it was another eight the other ace it's easy i won't remember that i will remember once it's colored then the the tie thing doesn't apply okay whatever uh did it did you go yet no no eight uh let's go high i really don't want to take this for a shot though queen let's go low <gasps> Why <are> you <laughs> okay, well, I oh, guess I have to take my purse. Good. All right. <laughs> Do we have something in the freezer for us already? I didn't put anything in the freezer. Oh, no. Sorry, I was busy. Yeah, no. Oh, so, wait, am I putting the cards back? Yeah, let's, once we finish, then we reshuffle. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, hi, Dana. And Sanina says, hi, guys. Ukraine is with you. <laughs> and we're with Ukraine. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to stick it in the freezer okay, for a okay. Yeah. Capital of Ukraine. Five, four, three, Capital two. Capital of Ukraine? What letter does it start with? I think W. I don't even know anymore. I, I thought it was like W? Um, then I don't know. I don't know the capital of Ukraine. Does anyone in the chat know? Warhol? No, that's the artist. Uh, it kind of sounds like that. You know what? The best thing about this is you do pop trivia and you don't even know the answer. I thought I knew, but then now I'm like, I'm like, I'm getting stuck. My brain's getting stuck. I have pregnancy brain. <laughs> Into the wild, welcome. And we are already at our 51 likes, so I'm going to change it to 100. We're going to let the Soji chill for a second. So oh, I, okay. I owe two and you owe one. Let's okay. just um, remember that. And thank I, you. Yeah, thank you for hitting the like button. Yeah. And I think we're ready to start cooking, though. No? Okay. Yeah. Uh, let's move everything because I'm going to make the sauce in that small pot first. Okay. So I'm just going to let me give, let me take this first. This. Do you need this now? Yeah. Who is hungry? Anyone hungry? Oh, this one? Oh, it does kind of work. Yeah. Okay. I have an aerial cam here, but I don't even know if I want to show it. bother with it today, so we'll see. All right, so... Um, Food tastes better if you use more flavors, right? Mm. So usually what makes Korean jajangmyeon is you have to fry the black bean paste in oil. Mm -hmm. But instead of using normal oil, because oil doesn't have any flavor, yeah, we made flavors. our own green onion infused oil. Oh, is that easy to make? Uh, super easy. You just throw green onions in oil and oh. fry it up until it becomes like... Look, I mean, it kind of looks like a little hot. Yeah. Uh, I mean, it's all it's not hot anymore, but do you think this will taste good? Mm. Oh, okay. Oh, try it. Oh, my gosh. It's not salted, so it doesn't have any, like, flavor. But it, oh, reminds, it looks crunchy. But it reminds me of the Vietnamese, like, 
toppings and some of the cuisine, no? Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's like very concentrated onion flavor. Yeah. Ooh. Sean says, I always thought this dish took forever to make. This is the first time I've ever seen it made from scratch. So how long is this going to take from start to finish? Let's guess. We're starting cooking at 6.32. Well, we, okay. Well, because like we chopped the vegetables kind of smaller because mm -hmm. I was thinking it might take a while to cook, but whatever. Okay. So we're going to add some oil here. Maybe half of this. All right, tell me if you guys would appreciate the other angle, and I will switch to it, but there's a small chance it might not come back to this camera. Uh, Tom guesses 40 minutes. Okay, let me let me get this set up real quick, sorry, so people can see. It's this webcam, I believe. There might be a slight lag. She's thick. Now, how much do you even add? I don't know. I'm just eyeballing it. Oh, careful. It's taking oh, over. Okay, thank you. She's thick. Okay. Oh. It's very aromatic in here, guys. Oh, you can for sure smell it. Yeah. yeah. We're going to switch back to the other <laughs> angle because <laughs> I had a hard time keeping it steady there. So you guys got the gist of it, right? T Beavers, welcome. And Candace, we were in the same boat. It was hard to focus at work considering the election. There's a lot of different things going on in our heads, I feel like. Okay. Does it look like it's um kind of like okay. yeah. do you wanna tilt it that way maybe? Do you guys see that? Tom says it's like roofing tar. <laughs> I mean, he's not wrong. Should we build a house using jadang sauce to be our roofing tar? <laughs> Hi, Brenda. Welcome. And Sean says it looks like the La Brea tar pits. Does it? Yeah. It definitely won't taste like it. Oh, Candace, thank you so much for the super chat. Hope y'all lose the game so you can take a well-deserved shot after a crazy week. Well, yeah, I owe two, you owe one, and so we got to play another game. Thank you so much for that. Hey, let's let's play that once Mark has a handle on what he has to do with the sauce. Okay, so move. let's move the pot to the side because now we're gonna cook the meat and the vegetables. So am I bringing this back that I can unload these? Mm -hmm. So this is kind of salty. Oh, so you don't even need that much. Right? I don't know if I put it on all the way, so don't take my word for it. Perfect. Yeah, I did. I, yeah, I, you might have to adjust it. Yeah, it looks perfect. Thank okay. you. Heavens World, welcome to the live stream. Again, if you guys are new and you have not yet subscribed to our channel, please consider subscribing and hang out with us tonight. Avril, you may have missed the roll call. We did it earlier in the evening. It has been a rough week, and we're so happy you're here. So I'm just grabbing some ingredients. Okay. So we got pork here. We got onions. That seems to be the talk of the town. Mark did get a haircut. Yes. <laughs> wow. I should get a haircut every day. Please don't. <laughs> uh, Stray Cat, this is uh, definitely not spicy at all. And I don't even know what that word is, Ed. It looks like meconium. Body. 
Ed's comment? It looks like meconium. What does? What probably does? the only thing we've shown is probably this, but I don't even know. That sounds like a chemical. I don't know what that is. Do share. Tell us what that is. Are you saying black bean noodles is way better than a gingerbread house lobe? And this is Bonnie's favorite noodles. Awesome. Well, then I'm hoping that you really enjoy the stream. Ah, Tony says that's baby's first poop. Yeah. <laughs> There's a name for that. The black poo thing, the very first poop, yeah. And Tina, we did use capsaicin powder in, uh, in the chat. If you guys remember, what did we use capsaicin powder in? It was in a recent stream, I think. Okay. I realize with this pan, I don't really need the other angle because you see it so well the way it's like the shape. Yeah. Okay. All right. So sorry. Since that's heating up just really quickly, let's do a quick round of the cards. Yeah. Okay, ready? You are first. Seven. Oh, higher. Two. Oh. oh no. And then I'll take care of myself. Is okay. okay. Yeah. Five. Higher. Oh. oh, so tied. Show people the card when you I don't know. I'm sorry. I was just Trying to like get through it. Okay, so Mark is adding the fork. So now I have to drink three shots and Mark will drink two. And then if you guys want us to get up to another one, hit that like button. Uh, Tina, we have played that. Uh, there's a baby shower game where they put a bunch of chocolate candies in a diaper and melt it, and you have to guess what the candy is. Oh, yeah. I'm not really good at that because I don't really know candy names as much, but it really disturbs me when there's nuts in them. <laughs> this baby, why are you eating nuts? Yeah. I mean, if they want to be, I, if, we ever, if we ever did a baby shower, it would be funny if one of them had corn in it. <laughs> right? Because we haven't seen that yet. So, is there a chocolate with candy corn in it? Ew. And does anyone like candy corn? Hopefully no one else is having audio issues. Sorry, Candace. It sounds like they're underwater. Let me go check to make sure everything's plugged in. Is it plugged in? Yeah. Oh, we have a PHK IP event with like candy corn. Oh. The sound is off. All right, well, let's see what I can do about that. Oh, my Yeti. Oh, we didn't change the mic. Or did it once I change the webcam? Good call. How are we now? Better testing. One, two, three. Sound check. Hello. Hey guys, James and Mark here with another mukbang. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up, comment, and subscribe. Oh my goodness, T Beavers! What a super generous super chat. Oh my god. Can y'all cheer up? And please, please, let's not talk about the election. Oh, yes. Thank you so wow. much. Wow. Wow. That is so generous. Yeah. I mean, TV Bruce, you may have missed the very beginning of the stream, but we said that we'd like to use this time and space to take a mental break from everything that's I been know. going on this week. So we, we all deserve a mental break. Yes. So we have to play the game again. I'm going to get the soju started because if oh. I stack those sojus back to back, I will die. How many? Um, I do need to do three. You need to do two. And we still owe a game. We look kind of zoomed in than before. Did something happen? Uh, let me adjust. 
maybe switching. The, yeah, maybe things. I don't know which way to twist, so you're just gonna have to bear with me. Don't do. Oh, you, you're right. You're right. Yeah. Keep doing that. Mm -hmm. This looks like Let's, it's zooming. No. Oh. Okay. Better. That's so weird because this is protruding out as I did that. But you said it's going back. Unless I'm going crazy. <laughs> Unless I'm going crazy and I was twisting it thinking it was going to. We're good, right? We're good. Okay. I'm supposed to get the so you. So if you're just joining us, we are making jajangmyeon, uh, which is the black bean noodles. <laughs> I'm sure if you've never had it, I'm sure you've seen it, especially if you watch mukbang videos, because it's actually a popular mukbang video where like people do to eat for mukbang, huh? Yeah. So we're just uh, cooking up our pork meat. I cut the pork a little bit bigger because I, for me, I like it when the pieces are bigger than my chicken. I don't have a preference, so I'll see after tonight. If I can't, we got chummy right now. Oh, I can't even imagine doing three of these right now. What kind of, what cut of pork is that? Um, the, this is the pork. I'm going to say shoulder. Shoulder, maybe? That's not lean cut of pork. Cheers. Cheers. Hmm. Hey, Sam, we need to uh, get a link together because everyone's been asking about this pan. I, this so is we, one of our favorite pans. It's so versatile and what we could cook with it. We can make ramen, gopoki. Do we want to call the, the pan company? Slap our James and Mark logo on it because they've been getting free advertising for months now. Yeah. And then sell them and we should get a cut. What do you guys think about that? Uh, Serenity, hi, welcome. And Julie says, I had to watch the cheese slap video because of you guys. <laughs> I almost peed myself. Wow. All right, so this is cooking up nice and good. I'm going to give myself like a second before I take the next one. Ooh, this was an insta headache. Hashtag insta headache. This chummy, you know, you said it recently. Sometimes chummy is so good, and sometimes chummy is so bad. What is it for you today? Today tastes good. Mm. Mm. Is the heat on too high, or it's okay? Yeah, let's put forward a little bit. There we go. Welcome, Hartwell Pools. And when will y'all get merch? It's it's on our to-do list. I think we're gonna it's gonna come sooner rather than later. I'm hoping that we can get it out before Thanksgiving, but who knows? Do all your holiday shopping. <laughs> Just kidding. Can you imagine if like, like someone did do that and it's like what's like your name opens and like uh things? I think our logo is pretty cool though. Oh yeah, I, I mean like our it's been there forever. But for that to be our logo, we haven't really eaten hamburgers that often, have we? No, not at all. Yeah. Tom says, I guess there's a lot of pork in this dish. <laughs> uh, Nevaeh says, hi, welcome. And Brenda is saying, Hedu merch. Oh, the Hedu merch will actually do way better than... Uh, welcome, Valentina. Seems like more people would buy Hedu merch. A long, long, long time ago, I made Hedu, not Hedu, I made Mark a Hedu t-shirt. Oh, yeah. It was a silhouette and it was all black. And then it even had his harness, I think. Yeah. And I did a, a red outline of that. Welcome, Henok Zambui. And Crystal Clear says, making spicy rice cake and miso soup for dinner. Mm, that sounds good. Yeah. We should do that soon. Uh, 
Sure showed oh, our yeah. vegetables. Yeah. Um, what do you guys see there? Ooh. We got some cabbage. cabbage. Onion. And is that squash? Zucchini. Oh, zucchini. And then we have our potatoes, yeah. Yeah. Thanks for the while. I can't wait to buy your merch. Hi, Lola. Welcome. Oh, that's right. Into the Wild's boyfriend is James Love. I feel oh, like you yeah. told us this before. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. so sorry if I forgot. You guys should have a logo type thing like how Hyani has the pink bow. Yeah, ours is the camera with the hamburger in it. But oh, it's on screen. Oh, yeah, it's right there. <laughs> but we don't like really push for it. Yeah. yeah, we'll talk about it or push for it. We know how to speak Spanish, but not not enough to just be able to like carry on full conversations. And again, hit that thumbs up button if you haven't. I'm gonna pour the next round of shots. Oh yeah, this headache that. is killing me. That means your body wants more. Simsa? I don't know. And we owe one more game. Cheers. Thank you, Hartwell says that looks good. And Jerome says, hello, my favorite YouTuber. Oh, hello. What's up, Jerome? Okay, if you guys just join us, we are making the early stages of a Jajangmyeon dish. And Tina, we will be having that Thanksgiving food sandwich. I don't know if we'll actually record a video of it, but for sure we're gonna have We're gonna order it for sure. And we'll um, share all the information. So if you guys are in the immediate area, you guys can check it out yourself. It's delicious. Oh, I didn't chop this potato well. That looks like an onion. Oh, is it onion? Onions you could break apart because they're layered. It has the lines, so it. Oh yeah, you're right. It's an onion. Uh, Brenda says, "What about the camera lens with nudes in the middle instead of the hamburger?" That's an option. Like noodles? Yeah, not not, not nude. Oh, at ourselves. first I thought it was nude. Uh, and we are adding seafood, Hannah, yes. Brittany says, hi everyone, James and Mark. My wife and I love you guys. Oh, thank you so much. Uh, and if we don't know this about you guys and you're new to our stream, answer these three questions in the chat. Where are you from? What's your favorite food? And how did you find us? Oh, I should, I should start boiling the water. Yeah. What's up, Assassin? Thanks for dropping by. It smells good. Oh, it does smell really good. It does smell good, huh? Yeah. Uh, Low rule says blank or regular. I can't read that Korean word. Kanjajang or regular? We're doing regular. Oh, what's kanjajang? Uh, it's a little bit. It's the same thing, but the, the sauce is less um, watery. Watery. Mm. Yeah. I have no idea why there is more spam tonight. It comes in waves. Hopefully. Hi, Nicole, welcome. And Daniel, yes, so close to 20K. Help us get there. So if you're watching and you're not subscribed, please uh, consider subscribing. We're trying to get to 20,000 subscribers. Yeah. By end of the year? Mm, yeah. By end of the year. Hartwell, right, well, I don't think we have any favorite recipes. We just love food in general. Anything that tastes good that we can make is considered our favorite. We're gonna do Korean barbecue soon though. Yeah. Because we're thinking about doing that tonight. Yeah. Uh, hi Catalina, welcome. And Island Candy said, Oh my MG, I just had that more pork, please. We're actually gonna 
this is um, as much pork we're going to add because we're going to be adding seafood. So we want to make sure everyone has an equal chance <laughs> at representation. Mm -hmm. And Sue Baker, yes, this is the first time Mark is making this dish as I, far as I know. Yeah, I've never made this before. But it looks like he knows what he's doing. He always ordered it, you know. Yeah. But Julie is from Wisconsin, Sushi, and just randomly found us. Been watching you for months, but never joined your live. Oh, thanks. Well, I'm so happy that you're here for the live. Uh, Hannah says, will there be a special Christmas mukbang? Hmm, we don't know yet. We haven't thought that far ahead. We went from basically St. Patrick's Day to Thanksgiving in the blink of an eye, I feel like, I this know, year. Oh, that's crazy. Yeah. Yeah. Assassins from Vietnam. Awesome. Leslie says, hello, guys. I've been wanting to learn how to make this. We had bulgogi mandu tonight. Oh, Ooh, that sounds, sounds delicious. Good. Yeah. Irie, welcome. There, uh, so for our streams, we typically don't sing on Fridays. So make sure you subscribe and you can catch us singing on Mondays. Uh, Family is Life says, I really love you guys. I want to stay up till 2 a.m. till you finish. Just want to say thank you for always making us happy and having a laugh. You make so many people happy. You both are great together. Oh, thank you thank so much. You. Okay, so I'm creating a little well. Oh. And then we're going to add our sauce in here. Okay. I'm going to, should I hold it like this so people can, oh wait, how do you, here, I'll just give it to you. <laughs> yeah, sorry, I mean, it's, it's because it's hard. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Ooh, that looks like that'll be fun to clean later. I know. I'm just looking at this. I was like, Ugh. okay, thank you. Should I just soak it now? Yeah. So this is the black bean paste that we cooked in oil first. And then just recooking it with the leftover oil with just a little bit before I start mixing. Uh, so assassins from Vietnam, favorite food is nuggets, and you're my favorite YouTube. Oh, thank you. We Super. Haven't, we haven't been to Vietnam. Mm -mm. Okay. Oh, that looks good. Julie says, Christmas mukbang with fireball eggnog. That sounds good. Never had that. I do love eggnog, though. Yeah. OK, let's add our seafood in. So here's the seafood. We got calamari, or squid, shrimp, and scallops. This is an elevated jajangmyeon, for yeah. sure. We did mail-in. Donna, thank you for the support. Keep up with this awesome site. You'll have 100,000 by then. We hope so. And Brittany says, we currently live in Miami. I can't say I have a favorite food because I love food. Love trying new things. Found you guys through my wife, Stephanie. Well, tell Stephanie we say thank you for introducing you to us. We're so happy that you guys both get to watch us together. Anju Khan says, good cooking watching from Canada. Hello. Now, we didn't ask people this. Who has ha tried this dish before? Who yeah. had black bean noodles before? Uh, can we turn the air on too? Yes. I'm getting warm. Tuning back in, had to close down the department. Hi, Joshua, again. Do you like closing down? Sometimes, like, I remember in my earlier, like, days, of working mm -hmm. closing down was like always nerve wracking like oh am i like doing this right am i setting the alarm right you know it's like yeah it's, it's so nerve-wracking you know crystal clear asks have we had malaysian food yes we've had it a few times probably not as often as we would like but we've had it a few times yeah um bonnie says i think mama d's world also added broth to loosen the paste Unicorn says, hi, guys. Welcome. Love the video. 
Layers Blossom says, hey guys, been away for a while. What's going on? Happy Friday. Happy Friday to you too. Not much. Just still here doing our mukbang thing and hanging out with you all. Oh, that air feels good. Island Candy suggests seafood paella for the holidays. Miriam says, I recommend you watch Marion's Kitchen. She has some very delicious recipes. I think you guys would love some of her recipes. Yeah, we'll check, we'll check that channel out. Yeah. Okay. Can you do me a favor? Yeah. Pour that water in. Okay. How does it look? It looks legit. No. It does. Now, is there a specific spot or? I just poured it. All of it or just a uh, little? I did measure it out, so all of it. Oh, sorry. With that spot thing, you did it again. Maybe? Yeah, all of it? Um, I'm going to trust you, but. Yeah, because we're going to add our slurry in. Oh, okay, so yeah. I think it up. Yeah. Well, there you go. Because the water is needed to, to cook the potatoes down a little bit more. Yeah. TVVers asked if we have any holiday traditions related to New Year's. I would say more so with like Lunar New Year, but not necessarily with the... Well, we eat the Korean rice cake oh, that's soup right. yeah, that's every a tradition. New Year day. We never did a video on that. But we never did a video because we look horrible. <laughs> yeah. We usually drink for New Year's Eve. If we did that video, maybe we can wear like a mask or something. <laughs> no. Which reminds me, I I don't think we played TV verse okay. game. We both took two shots already. I did too, yeah. So I have to still, still take a third one and then we play this game again. And then how many likes are we at, guys? And we are from the US. We're in Southern California. Mark saying slurry reminds me of DJ Slurry. Oh, this? Uh, the lid. Oh. So this pan doesn't come with a lid. And the other lids that we have is kind of too small. And this is the only one that kind of fits. So it kind of looks like a, you know, what, I want to eat food out of that food dome. What are you, what, what, there's a name for that. Food dome. You know, oh, like that, the it looks like this. Yeah, yeah. You open the lid. Usually I see them on like dessert shows and there's always like, like fog or something in it. And they open it and all of it comes out, right? Is that what you're talking about? No, no, no. Not the oh, smoker. The cloche. Is that what it's called? Is that what it's, it's called? It's like the when the butler. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, yeah. And then they open the lid. I think lid. it's called a cloche. Can someone corroborate that? <laughs> I don't want to sound stupid. All right. Mark's going to go first. And Kim Woo Young says cloche. So oh. I think I'm right. Three. Higher. Ten. Lower. Nine. Lower. No. That was an ace. Ace. Sorry. Ten. Sorry, Charlie. Okay. What is that? Ten? Nine. Let's go higher. Oh, it's seven. <laughs> oh, so you lost. So you wait, you still need to do a shot. Oh, I still needed two. Now you have to do two. Now I have to do two. And I do okay. one. So let's just do, let's just even this out now. Okay. Happy oh, Friday. And we got a super sticker from oh. Stray Cat. So we will get to that in a moment. Thank you so much. So especially with this dome lid that we have on right now, I can't see the chat, so. Please forgive me. I should check on the water. Oh, so since a lot of you guys know the word cloche and look like you know how to spell it, can anyone let us know how to spell the word zhuzh in the chat? I don't we... even know how to say it. <laughs> so like yesterday when you did say it, it wasn't like entirely right, but you saw, you talked so fast, no one noticed, so it doesn't matter. But here, that was my strategy. I was like, oh, we did a good job divisioning it up. I don't yeah, know. yeah, no, definitely you did say that, <laughs> I, right? I had to use my shoulder, too, to help me, like, division it up. I so was like, yeah. he, here's here's an example of how we'd use it in a sentence. Mark added seafood to zhuzh up the jajangmyeon. Okay, zhuzh. You're saying it, yeah. I'm saying it right. It's zhuzh. Does anyone know how to say that word? Or do they spell that word? Is it even a word? <laughs> 
Did we get to 101 likes? Let me double check. Make sure that actually happened. Do, 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 do. We indeed got to 101, so that's another uh, shot. And then we also got another super chat from Low Rules, Jia Jiangyan, and Soju. My goodness, everyone trying to get lit tonight. It is Friday. Yeah. Right? And Stray Cat's super sticker was the how's it going pair. Ooh, we are going well. So, quick question we're not cricket, right? Because our camera looks cricket. It looks super crooked. Our camera looks really crooked. You know what? I think our viewers are really good at letting, letting us, us know, know if something's up. If so we like, have like a technical difficulty. Yeah. Oh, you can't see, but um, I'm making a slurry right now. Yeah. And what's the slurry made up of? Um, so this has potato starch and water. If you don't know what a slurry is, if you add it to anything that is already liquidy, it makes it thicker. You could use cornstarch. You could use um, uh, sweet white sweet rice starch, mm. um, but we had potato starch on hand. Yeah. So it seems like you don't really see too many spellings of that word. A zhuzh. I see J-U-S, J-H-U-S-H-J-U-J-E. Yeah, I don't know how to spell that word. Cody says, shout out from Taipei. Welcome. Welcome, Marianne. Thanks for being here. So Josh says it's Z-H-U-Z-H. -H. So Z-H-U sounds, looks like a Wait, Chinese word. Z-H-U-Z-H. -H. Hey, what's the, that's, uh, um, you know, when the word, like Hannah is, H A N N A, -A. like when you, oh, when you palindrome. Pal that's a palindrome. It's not because then it should have the Z oh, at the end. Oh, so. Where's my shot? <laughs> yeah. Wait, how many more games do we? Oh, I should have put another one in the freezer. Okay, this one is poured all the way. Uh, this is for the light goal. Thank you. This is for the light goal. Oh, I want to put another. Jajangmyeon. I hope it's good. Um, you could tell if it's like almost on cooking by the potatoes. Oh, but I can't. I can't seem to find one. Is this a potato? No, that's a scallop. You look like a potato. No, that was a zucchini. Where's the potato? So if I'm not mistaken, we owe two more games, right? Yeah, because you said we got straight cat, cat, straight cat and, and lobe. lobe. Okay. We have two games. So let me shuffle these cards. Nice and good. Oh my gosh, I don't see us. Did the did I add potatoes? That's a scallop, scallop. Oh, here. This has to be okay. You have to be a potato. You look like one. <laughs> Oh, it still has a few more minutes. And yeah, we reduce it so that the sauce gets a chance to thicken up. You don't want to eat your jajimyeon soupy. No. And again, we're adding our slurry too, so that's going to really thicken yeah. it up really well. Uh, Rachel says, hello from Austin, Texas. And in addition to letting us know where you're from, also answer these two additional questions for us. Where are you from? What's your favorite food and how did you find us? Sorry, I had to ask. It's hard. Party. It's hard to like. It's hard to just jump yeah. in right in the middle, you know? 
you're hardwired to ask the whole three. Yeah. All right, let's do um, Mark first. Nine. Uh, I'm gonna say lower. Queen. <laughs> wow, we are not good at this game. Oh yeah, you lost. Oh, oh I should have just pretended. I know. I would, <laughs> I'm, I'm already like. Ah. Okay. King, King lower. Dip it low. It's pick it up be slow. Ace or tie. Ace or tie. <gasps> Jack oh, lower. Jack. That's close. Four, Four. higher. King, lower. Ace or tie. Two. Ace. Oh, good. All right, so you need to do one, and I'm, am I reprieved yet or no? Am I behind one? I'm not, I don't even know. I don't know what you are. Okay, well, we need to do two more. We just got another super chat from Jamie, so we have to play two more oh, times okay. total. Okay. So you're gonna go first? Yeah. Ace. Uh, I'm gonna say red. Red. Oh my god, yes! Oh you didn't win though. You still got three cards left. I don't know why you're prematurely celebrating. Higher. Oh. So you have to do two in total now? Okay. And then two shots for Mark. Okay. okay. Six. Higher. Ten. Show. Show. Oh. Uh, thing. Yeah. Lower. Six. Higher. Nine. Lower. Seven. Oh. Okay. So you're two. Two and what one. are you? One. Okay. But then we still have to do. So we just played twice. So we need to play one more, right? Oh, for okay. Jamie. For Jamie, yeah. Or the, you just said that, right? I okay. forgot. Jack. Who's going? You, Me? Oh, yeah, lower, lower. So I have to do three shots. You lost shots. all three. Oh, I lost all three. Okay. Three. Lobe, Stray Cat, and Jamie. Wow, that was a death of me for those three games. Okay. Four. I'm going to go higher. Oh my gosh. Yes, it's a three. James lost. Oh, uh, you do three. I do two. Oh. But you're behind one, so you do so three. So I'll just two. do three. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Patricia, thank you for joining. Uh, Aiden says, sorry, I missed a lot of the stream. No worries. Thanks for being here. What is ironic is that I had jajang bop today and the food looks good. Oh, jajang bop is good too. Yeah. But I, but if I have it, I'm going to start thinking like, oh, I missed the noodles. Yeah. But I love carbs. I love rice. Yeah. I love noodles. Yeah. <laughs> Laura says, you two will be trash before this is over. I think we'll be okay. We drink it. We drink it. We drink a lot more than this. Uh, can we? Let's show the noodles. Oh yeah. I'm thinking maybe we only need two strands. Two strands. But this comes in the refrigerated section of the Korean market. This is specifically for jajang, mm. you know, or jampong. Oh yeah, jampong. They use the same noodles. You know. Ooh. So when do you add the slurry? Um, I'm gonna add it closer to when, when the, the potatoes are like the close. potatoes are done. Yeah. Loeb, I don't think we're gonna do the fried egg business because that's just another component to like deal with right now. We told ourselves even Friday has just gotten a little bit more involved than we would like when we first started. When we first started out, I think we got takeout. Did we get like sushi or something? The first Friday night live we ever did. What's up, Dish? What's up? Oh. <gasps> I did put a soju in the freezer, right? Yeah. Yes. Do you want to open this for me? Oh, I think some of you mentioned this before, but I just love that we have our butcher paper. I'm just putting dirty spoons down and I'm not caring about dirtying the, you know, the tabletop. Oh, this is heavy. Wait, so what do I do after I open it? Just open it and then? Yeah, just open it. I don't know if you guys can see the noodles any better, but there's four, it's pretty heavy. There's four row, uh, columns of noodles. Does this mean that if each, each column is, is a serving? serving? It's just five servings though. And there's only four. Huh. Why, like, why, they, why not just do? 
Why not just do? Yeah. I don't think we need the lid actually. That way. So I'm gonna start cooking the noodles. How about that? Yeah. Okay. So we're cooking our noodles on camera. Uh, like transferring the noodles into the sauce. Yes. Rachel says, we found you through Hyani Eats. Our favorite food is sushi. Okay, but so your favorite food is sushi. However, like if you had to pick your top three like fish, what would it be? My mouth is watering. Mine too. Again, hit that thumbs up button if you haven't yet and subscribe as well. Try to get us to 20,000 by the end of the year. I can let you guys know exactly where we're at because 19.1 is very vague, but then in our little app, it tells you exactly how many, how many years. We're at 19,134. It'd be great to get to 19,200 by the end of this, but that I don't know if that'll happen. So if you just joined, Mark is off camera. He is cooking the noodles in some boiling water. And then he's gonna transfer it once it's ready to this pot. Maybe I should stir it and look like I'm oh, contributing. Yeah, I'm gonna lower the heat just a little bit. Yeah, spread the word. We really appreciate that. I think we can add the slurry now. Okay. Sometimes I'm like wondering if I get like a facial by sitting so close to all the steam. Ooh. Okay. Let's see how this is going to thicken this up in a matter of minutes. Rachel says salmon, tuna, and yellowtail. I think we're the same person. Oh. Those are like my go-to too. Though like tuna, like tuna in Japan was amazing. I don't eat tuna too much here unless it is the what's bluefin the, tuna. Bluefin unless tuna. Unless it's yeah. a bluefin tuna. Yeah. Um, do you guys have blank? I'll do. The very top. Tamuji, we do. We have tamuji and we have the Chinese kimchi. Hmm. Mark came prepared. I came prepared. Julie says the sauce is not as black as I have seen it. <laughs> Maybe it's the lighting, but it looks pretty black to me. Oh, it's, I guess it's kind of brown. Brenda says salmon belly, otoro, and botan ebi. I know you didn't ask me, but I love sushi too. Girl, that's fine. I love sushi. We, we love, love sushi. sushi. And you know what? Growing up, you know, I didn't really think, you know, I didn't give yellowtail like, mm -mm. I, would just, I would just eat it, but then I was like, it wasn't a favorite. But these days, a really good yellowtail is good. Yeah. Right? Yeah. It's like yellowtail, more like hello tail, like <laughs> get in my mouth. It's so good. Can you tell it's already thickened up? Yeah, yeah. adding it. Yeah. Yeah, hello thickened up. Ed is also a fan of yellowtail. Like, I think the camera itself is making it look a certain color, but it, it looks like Jajangmyeon color over here. Oh, that's a great idea, Julie. They have Sushi Mondays at our house. We should start doing that. One less thing to have to, like, figure out what to eat for that day, because you already know what you're going to do, right? Like pizza Fridays. Or yeah. Hannah, we don't do the spinning of the wheel on Fridays. So dessert is more just if we feel like it, I guess. 
Nicole, welcome. Good evening, handsome duo. <laughs> I need to tell Mark to essentially write out recipes because we don't really, like we show you guys, but we don't really have measurements and all of that. That's just usually an extra step that we overlook because it's just. I, I, yeah. <laughs> Nancy, welcome. Hello, I'm new here. Is Mark the main cook? Absolutely, he's the main cook on our channel. Yes. Oh, but James cooks too, and he cooks really well with the spaghetti a few weeks ago. That was, a few weeks ago was really good. The Indian food was probably my proudest moment this year. Oh, though, that was, that really was just good. so out of yeah. my element. Oh, and the bun sale recently was good too. Yeah. Uh, but Nancy, since you're new, let us know where you're from and what's your favorite what's food, your food and how did you find us? <laughs> let the expert asking of questions. That's true. Yeah. I overstepped my boundaries. Hi, Marie. Welcome. Nora says, I bet when the noodles are in it, it will look the right color. We shall see. Now everyone is like interested. Mmm. Try some of the sauce. I'm adding just like a little bit of salt. Okay. Uh, noodles. Noodles, noodles. Is this thickness the way you want it? Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. This is your first time watching our videos. We're so grateful that you're here. Nancy is from Northern California, San Jose. San Jose was literally one of the last places we visited before COVID-19. We visited all our friends back in January and we stayed next to this place called San Pedro Market. Is that what it's called? Oh yeah, in downtown San Jose. Yeah. Oh. It's good. Yeah. It's good. Yeah. And then I have a little bit of sugar. Do you want to add that in? Is it the whole thing? Yeah. Um, or just half? Or? Half for now. We love kimchi. We're actually going to be eating kimchi with this. So. Nancy loves Vietnamese, Korean, and Japanese food. Okay, we are the same person because those are the those are my top three cuisines. And found us on the sidebar while browsing YouTube. Awesome, William. I, we are cooking black bean noodles. This has pork. It has seafood. It has onions. Once we add the noodles, it will totally take it to the next level. I think we've been eating kind of the same, but I have a couple of people that I know that have been eating more this week, Candace. Oh well, yeah, I don't remember what was on the plate. <laughs> Ethan, welcome. Okay, let's turn off the heat. Mm. Nicole, our favorite dishes to cook are the ones that come out delicious. <laughs> mm. Oh, it's good, huh? Yeah, I didn't add all the sugar, so you can modify as you see appropriate. And Julie's been stuffing her face with ice butter cookies. What are What's that? Like I've heard of iced oatmeal cookies, but I don't know about butter cookies. That sounds good. <gasps> what is that? Sesame oil? Just a tad of sesame oil. Take it a little bit over the top. Make it a little nutty, you know? Lisa, you're so generous. She says, are you guys going to eat all that? If you can't, I can help you. <laughs> that looks so good. That is one of my favorite noodles. Yes. 
Did you guys know I watched you guys then on YouTube and on your lives on March? Yeah, that was that was some time ago. Is there any vegetables in it? William, yes, there are potatoes, there's onions, and there's zucchini, which could be considered a fruit, I guess, but it's potato. Culinary is a vegetable, scientifically yeah. it's a fruit. Marigold, welcome to our stream. Please hit that like button and also subscribe. So Mark is stirring in all the noodles in the sauce. We do not know who my cunt is. Do you know who my cunt is? Mm -mm. Should we know him? No, but now I just realized what I said and I shouldn't say that again. Thank you. <laughs> oh, is that Homer's? That's the, like a the Moses Lack the Simpson situation. Uh, but I guess that person just effectively banned themselves. So that's okay. What dish did you grow up eating? Everything under the sun. Everything. I don't know the kid. Welcome. Uh, that was not the whole pack of noodles, to my knowledge, uh, we right? We used two or three. Two or three. Two and a half, maybe. Two and a half of the thing. But it's a lot. Yeah. Right? Okay, how does this look? Beautiful. Um, I want to, let's move the grill, oh, the, the thing, what is, but let me grab the, and then when you come back, can you, um, bring one of the, etching? let's do this now. Okay. And then can you grab the, oh yeah, thank you. And then the kimchi. Do we need small plates or like, are we just eating straight from there? Or after you use that, we'll have plates or? Oh yeah, we need one more plate. One more small square one? And then I don't think the cucumber really does anything in terms of like the flavor of the dish, but it oh, definitely, color. It, helps. it definitely helps with the color, yeah. You need to use that oh, plate. Sure. <laughs> mm. I love just eating cucumbers. Who here? Who here likes cucumbers? Oh, I have to take a picture of this. Don't mind me, guys. Mm. Brittany says, what's for dessert? Uh, that's pending. I don't know if we're going to get to that. And then any karaoke tonight? Not tonight. But join us on Monday. You'll definitely get to see some of that then. Sorry. It's okay. I should probably do a little bit. Oh, no, that's fine. <laughs> and then this is going to be our side dish. We have our tamuji, mm, which, which is, is pickled radish. And then we have our Chinese style kimchi, which is they use a green cabbage instead of not, not, not the cabbage. Yeah. <sighs> You guys ready for this? Lisa, how are we ruining your diet? We're gonna take these calories in for you instead. And Nicole, we got this burner at um, H Mart, right? Or the burner? Yeah. I think so, yeah. God, the life in America says hi, welcome. Yes, thank you for the like. What is everyone having for dinner tonight? Happy Friday, everyone. Are we still gonna do the biggest bite possible later? Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even grab like a good, Thing of noodles. Do want a fork? No, it's okay. I'm just gonna annoy everyone by not having good chopstick skills. Okay, there we go. Okay. Cheers. Mmm. 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 Oh, it has like um, like a nutty yeah flavor. Yeah. Hmm. But a bean is not a nut. <laughs> it's not, but 
Oh, maybe it's because we added our sesame oil at the end. Mm. Is that the nutty flavor? But it's so subtle. Mm -hmm. I don't even, I can't tell. You know, like when you add sesame oil to certain things, you're like, that's a lot of sesame. I can't even tell. Mm. Peanut isn't a nut either. I always forget that. It's a legume, right? It's a what? Legume. <laughs> legume. You say just then. <laughs> What'd you say? Just. <laughs> I heard something else. Mm. Who said they like potatoes in this? Eddie, it came with oh. you. Let me try one and see what, what's all the rave about. Mmm. I think that was it. Chastity, welcome. <laughs> it's like such a huge pull and then like three strands of noodles. What helps me is like, I kind of also use my spoon mm. to like grab it. You know? We actually have some truffle oil, but it's like, I don't know how long we've had it for, so we probably wouldn't use it. <laughs> Avalon, that's a great question. What inspired you to create a mukbang channel? We really love food. Like we actually love food. So it's nice to be able to have a platform to show you guys how much we actually really do like it. Right? Yeah. Oh, are we? We still need to do our shots, right? Yeah. Two shots. Three each. Three each. But I'm gonna I need to hold off for a second because my brain. It's pounding. <laughs> Your brain's hitting the skull skin. Yes, <laughs> exactly. Oh my God, oh my God. Crystal, enjoy your sushi. Mmm. Did you try the seafood yet? I think I had a squid. Squid. I can't. The um. This is a scallop. The scallop right? and the potato look very similar. And then when I was trying to uh, fish for the potato to see if it was done cooking, like I kept grabbing the scallop. Mm. Oh, I like the squid in it because it's chewy. Mm -hmm. Kesha, thanks for dropping by. Welcome. Julie says three shots each. James is going to be topless by the end of the night. No. Should we make that happen? Topless? Will you? No. <laughs> mm -hmm. I love this pan. It's so versatile. Yeah. What do you need? Do you need a napkin? Oh, no. Yeah, yeah. I'll take one now. When you get a chance. Oh, I need shrimp. You just reminded me. Kenma says, you need a cold beverage with that. I know we're, we're down three shots. We owe everyone three shots. So hold us accountable. Oh. Jorge, welcome. And Deborah says, I just made some jajamyeon this week. Oh. You know what? So we never made this before, but now that we um, know how to make it. We no just, big deal. No big deal. Um, because usually when we do this to go, the noodles is all like hard and stuck together. Mm -hmm. So sometimes it doesn't taste good to go, but we don't have to worry about that anymore. Yeah. I don't know. Low rules. That's a good idea to get through my three shots. Is can we do somek with three shots of soju in it, or is <laughs> that too much? 
I don't know. Unicorn says you should start doing mukbangs real. Like, have we not been? Or like, or like, like yeah. What is it? Eating yeah. What do you mean by that? I want to like know. Massive eating mukbang. Lisa, both of our favorite food is like sushi. I think. What's the most difficult dish you've made? Uh, one time we made risotto and it was very, I thought that was very hard. Yeah. That was back at your like old, old apartment. Um, one time before we were even married on Valentine's Day, I made like dinner for James and I, I made a ravioli with oh. brown butter sage sauce. That was hard. Yeah, there was oh. a lot of work because the filling of the ravioli, you have to make, <laughs> you have to use a, um, not the blender, what is it called? The um, the chopper thing. Oh my God, food processor. Oh, yeah. yeah. And then you have to roll out your dough. Oh my, it was a lot of work. Is there anything Mark can't cook? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I feel like I'm not really good with dessert. I'm, I'm really not. Baking? Baking? I'm not really good at baking. <laughs> I love dessert though. Yeah. Right? Eventually, Hannah, we just haven't thought of the concept for another series quite yet. Any ideas? Is there any series you would like us to do? Mm. I don't think this is a lot of food. I feel like we're going to finish it. I'm already starting to feel like I'm tipping over on the shore of the beach. <laughs> that was the joke of the night the other day. Mm, Lobe has a flan recipe. Oh, and I love flan. I love flan, uh, creme brulee. I even had a flan, choco, choco flan cake. That's good. That's with the layer of chocolate cake. And there's a layer of, like a flan on top of that. Oh, for yeah. some reason I thought it was like a layer of like choco pie or something. Because yeah. whenever I hear choco, I think of choco pie first. They like branded themselves so well that I just think of them immediately. I, Island, I don't think we ever answered. So um, ultimately, Mark proposed to me, and there's actually a video of it on our channel. <laughs> I was so sick that day. Yeah. To the point where James is like, we don't, we should cancel our Vegas trip. We don't need to go. I'm like, no, nope, we're going. I plan everything. But he didn't know that, you know? Yeah. Mm. Why is this kimchi preferred to eat with this? Is think, this a better pairing or I don't think it's a better pairing. I think it's the um this is what the restaurant serves, so we have to like mimic that same experience. But normal kimchi would work perfectly too. Yeah. Okay. Oh my god. So let me take the chummy out because oh, it's been in the freezer for a while, yeah. Because I honestly think the busy is the one that's giving me the headache. What do you think so? Something is, and I can't even hide it. Ooh, oh, that was a good tornado. But I, I kind of covered it. That made my stomach churn. Turn the beat around. Hedu was in the picture well before we got married, Hannah. And Lisa says, challenge yourself with desserts. 
What dessert did I make last year that I was so proud of? Peanut butter cookies. Oh, that was good. I made peanut butter cookies that had the little peanut butter cup in the center of the cookie. It was for like a potluck? Mm-hmm. Mm. Cookie exchange. Cookie at work. Exactly. That I organized. I'm like the office party planner. Scared Charlie says hi, hi. How's everyone doing? Thank you for joining in. If you're new to our channel, please answer these two questions. Where are you from? What's your favorite food? And how did you find us? Um, the fourth bonus question is, are you subscribed? Mm. Right. Yeah. Let me take one more bite and then I'll do, I feel like I need a non busy chaser for this one. Oh, do you want me to juice Coke or Sprite or? Let's do Coke today. Oh. Mm. I thought it you was, did a good job. I thought it was gonna be a lot of food, but I think we're gonna finish it. And then with the leftover uh jajangmyeon sauce, we have to add rice to it and then mix it and then we're we gonna do it. that. Maybe. Should we? Okay, so we owe everyone three shots. That was one of the three. Are we taking a break or just doing a second one right now? Get it over with. Oh, uh, three? Just two, bitch. <laughs> oh, but then I feel like we're close to 150 likes. That could be mistaken, though. Sorry. Um, someone asked earlier who can handle spice better. <laughs> Stephanie, I think, asked that. Girl, if you only knew, if watch, you knew, watch our fire. We didn't we do like a fire noodle like series or something? Yeah, we had the you salmon can, with fire noodle sauce. You can actually just tell by looking at the thumbnail. <laughs> All the thumbnails, like spoiler alert, you could tell who. Uh, yeah, so we've already hit the one fifty. Oh my gosh! So we had to do. Four. We're we're just gonna finish the bottle because this is eight shots total. Yeah. So that's four four. So this is the second of. So we don't even need to yeah. count anymore okay. because we just need to finish this bottle. Unless someone like throws a curveball and like does a super chat and they're like, oh. or we hit 200 lights. Do I mean, we? I don't think we have chummy anymore. We have chummy. We have one like, more bottle the bar. In there. Yeah. Do we? Um, I don't think we. No, I when I just opened it, I don't think I saw it. But um, maybe, maybe. <laughs> Can you scroll for a second? Because wait, someone wait. did answer the three questions. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, oh, Susan. Oh, Susan San Francisco. Su oh, and your, her favorite food is jajangmyeon, what we're eating. Jinta. Wow. And from Angelina. You know, we haven't done jajangmyeon on our channel in a really long time. Yeah. I don't even remember. I don't think so. Sprite Cool says hello from Twitch. Welcome. Thanks for coming, joining yeah. in. Hi, Amelia, Cutie Pie, and Latoya Kamani says hi. You can do this without me for now. I will get there. Mm. I love your videos. Thank you so much. Do you watch us exclusively on Twitch? We have been getting a few more viewers on Twitch lately, so that's been awesome. So if you're watching us on there, we really appreciate the support. Did you eat any cucumbers there? They're not my favorite. Mmm, but it has that crispness. Shelly's having dinner with us. Mm. Hi, Ireland. Welcome. Eat some more. Do you want more? Are we eating rice? Are we eating rice? Who knows? Eat the rest of the noodles. It's a lot of noodles. No, it'll, it's only it's only mm. as, it's only this much. Okay. I feel like I ate a lot of noodles. That's why I want to be even, Steven. You know. But get to some of this kundagi. Oh, did you have a shrimp? I had two already. Okay. Thank you, though. You need more pork. So in Korean, the word kondegi mm -hmm. 
it means all the stuff in a like in a sauce or in a soup or stew. Oh, like the there's no English word for that. Like the you know the vegetables or yeah, like whatever's in it is called kundiki. Yeah, we don't have an English word for that. I don't think there's a word for it. Like the non-soup part is yeah. what we would have to say. That's right? called these are called kundigis. And then usually there's a lot of in Korean food there's a lot of vegetables that are the kundigis. Mm. So you hear moms say this a lot to their like little kids. Kundigi ta mogo, like eat all your kundigis. Yeah. Because do kids like try to avoid eating that? Because it's like vegetables, onions, mm. and stuff, you know. Who made the first move? That's a very complicated question. James did. Mark did. James did. Mark did. James did. James did. James did. Yeah. He left a comment on my Zynga post. Bish, do you think leaving a comment is making the first move? Yeah. Who? Who kissed who first? Because I certainly did not lean in for that. I didn't even know what was happening. Now you're embarrassed. No, I, was I your um, shiny armor night guy? Why? You were saving me from anything. I, no. you. Oh, did you say that? I don't even remember. You didn't say that. I just remember sitting in a dark room and it happened. That's all I remember. But it wasn't like, this might be too much. There was no tongue, right? It was just a kiss on the lips. No? Oh, but yeah. Yeah, Mark didn't like go all the way. I was like, where's the tongue? I was I was promised tongue and there was none. We probably had beef tongue at a Korean barbecue earlier that night. You got your tongue. What's the first love movie you ever watched together? Probably Mark made me watch some like Korean drama with him. Mm. It was probably the first one. I can't remember which one though. Do you remember Tropical Nights of in December? You got so sucked into that drama. You binge watched it. No, there was a day where Mark had, this was when Mark was working and I wasn't. And like we watched it all together in like episode 10. And then when he came home from work that day, I was like, I finished it. And I think I was like in tears or something. <laughs> <laughs> it was so bad. I don't really like get sucked into Korean dramas lately. I can, but I just don't even start it because I know how I will get sucked into it. Yeah. Like I try to avoid it. Uh, Eddie had a good question. Who farted in front of the other person first? I think for sure me. It's like Eddie, I feel like you asked that question to be a beach. I think like you know. I think James probably farted you know, and me you before asked. we even like Ew. Did any, like before the first before day, we right? did anything, what did we do? <laughs> we zhuzhed it up. Ew, we <laughs> yeah. Oh, so Yesenia, we were in a room that had no lights on. It wasn't like we were photographers filming, like doing our, oh, like they're not, not that kind of dark room. <laughs> the photographer like dark literally room. in a room that and had I lights on. spill chemical on James's eyes and he gets blind and I have to donate my eyeball to you. And then you realize and then you get all sad. Girl. That's the music. That was the famous music video. It was. Who sings that? Kiss. Because I'm. Is that a boy group, girl group, because or co-ed? Uh, girl, girl group. <laughs> I think we taught everyone the word zhuzh tonight. NX, welcome. And Ireland, thanks for dropping by. Susan to Sus says kiss. Oh, and then. That's the name of the song, because I'm a oh. girl. Uh, I've never watched the movie Bad Hair. Have you ever watched it? It was a sad music. Wasn't it like 30 minutes long too? <laughs> Maybe six Ten. minutes. It was it was long for what yeah. a music video standard was. Because it was a they tr they used the whole like let's turn this into a mini Korean drama yeah. angle. Yeah. Isn't there a scene where like they're getting rolled by each other and I'm oh, like, in a, in a, uh, Would that really happen though? Like I don't know. 
Maybe we should we should watch it and just do commentary on it because I'm sure it's ridiculous nowadays. Maybe like, like yeah, back then we'd be like, oh, so sad. Oh, uh -huh. but then I just remember some of my friends would just watch it on repeat and just hug a pillow and they're crying. Hug a pillow and cry. Yeah. Da, 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 da. Right? Is that the? <laughs> but you know what that group were they weren't even that popular like that music video was popular but after that one hit one hit wonder, wonder yeah one hit um, wonder um, but that wasn't that wasn't even a big hit to begin with yeah, yeah. Michelle May says, my first K-drama and favorite would be Autumn in My Heart. Did you watch that? Oh, my gosh. You need, I think you watched it, actually. Mm -hmm. I watched Stairway to Heaven. It Autumn in My Heart was before Stairway to Heaven. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. You have to watch it if you haven't watched it. Do you think it'll like translate in today's time, or will oh, it seem dated? It might, it's, it'll seem dated. It's probably it was filmed in, like, 99, maybe? It's not that long ago. Right? Oh, you know the movie Miss Wife, the husband. Who's Miss Wife? No, Bom well, Jones movie. Okay. Where she wakes up in a different like. Yeah, movie. I barely remember that one. Do we literally watch that movie once? Right. Let's watch it again. Oh. But the guy, he's good looking, but um, he was an auto in my heart. Song Song Hoon. Kim Young's first drama was Coffee Prince. Wasn't that like recent? Eddie, you're not that young. And who's Gong Yu? I've heard of Gong Yu. You're not that young for Coffee Prince to be your first. I know. That's drama. what I was thinking. Because I was like, Do you not recent? watch anything as a kid? I think the first one that I fell in love with was, I think it was filmed in 97. It's called uh, it's The Star in My Heart. <laughs> Why do all the dramas have like. A season, a star, a heart, like there's always something. Like Pyonine Kasume, something like that. Pyonine Kasume. Oh, we got uh, another Korean. Algo Lijime Toso Wabaninde Hangukuni Seneo. Oh, so this person just landed on our channel didn't realize that one of us is korean oh yeah we should greet them mark james you mean that oh i guess he was in goblin but i don't know do we add rice to this do you want rice like I'll eat rice, but I'm not gonna eat a lot. I'll just take the two bites. Good. Okay, um, let me heat it up. Time for rice, guys. <laughs> Apparently, uh, Biden is talking right now. This is the moment of truth. You guys can choose to watch him or us. My first drama was Stairway to Heaven, and my first film was Sassy Girl, the 2000 one. Oh, was Sassy there an earlier Girl. one? No, they did a remake of Sassy Girl, mm. I think. Sassy Girl was a good movie. I don't think I ever watched that one either. Yucky Jogging Kunyo? Yucky. Yucky. Yucky Toki. Do you remember Yucky Toki? Uh, Marshmallow Rabbit. His Korean name was Yopki Oh, I don't know that. It looks, it's like a, you know, imagine like a Sanrio type of character, but it's a white bunny. Mm -hmm. He's slant eyes. But he does gross things. That's why he was so popular. Is he the same bunny that's on Kakao Talk or is that a different no, bunny? No, probably different. But Yopki Toki was so popular. But his yeah. English name was um, Mosh and then Melo. Because he kind of looks like a marshmallow. Yeah. 
Someone asked if my headache went away. It's what do I do? Drink more water? You said drinking more would help, girl. Maybe your hat's on too tight. <gasps> Is it? It's on the last notch. <laughs> no, actually, I can do one more notch. You're rude. But then I started believing you. <gasps> oh my god, it does feel better. <laughs> It does. That one notch made all the difference. Oh my gosh. Full House. I've heard of Full House. Never watched that either. Elle says, I'm so old. Elle, are you older than us or younger than us? And Roy says, hello, welcome. Again, if you guys haven't yet, hit that subscribe button. Hit it right now. Hit this. Me. Uh, yeah, and Answer these two questions in the chat. Uh, where are you from? What's your favorite food? And how did you find us? And please let us know if you actually did hit that subscribe button. Uh, Eddie says, James is going through alcohol withdrawal. Shots is a cure prescribed by me. What was that word he said earlier? Men don't come? Men don't come? <laughs> Men don't come? No, oh, what was the word? Macorium? The, no, uh, the baby. It started with an M. I didn't mean to say men don't count. Because they do. <laughs> it's okay. It's seven fifty three now. Some men can't. <laughs> Some men can't. <laughs> oh my god! How about sister sister? Is that a drama movie? That's or Tia and Tamara? <laughs> oh, they're sister, on Netflix sister. now. Oh, are they showing oh an god. episode? They're on Netflix. We should watch it. Oh, I love fun. Sister Sister and then the mom. Well, oh, Hedy came out. Hedy, come here. What's the mom's name? Tell well, I know her real life name was Jackie. Harriet. I don't know. No, that's oh, that's no. That might be Family Matters. <laughs> Harriet. Yeah, Harriet Winslow. And then uh, Fresh Prince mom is Victoria. Vivian. Vivian. Yeah. And then I just watched a Fresh Prince of Bel Air clip this last week did you it was the one i don't know I, I never remember watching the episode but then it became a popular like short facebook clip where she goes to the ballet class and she oh. doesn't know like these two women underestimate her because she looks older and then also she busts out and all the moves and then she leaves class and then she passes out so but that's that's when they didn't ex really explain why the mom changed after season they never one. did yeah but didn't they make a joke about it? I think she gave birth and then she was a change one. Did she did she have another kid? No, I don't remember. Another kid. Well, because they had Hillary, uh -huh. Carlton, and Ashley. Wasn't there a little boy? No, but that's the aunt's kid. No, but the aunt is Vivian. No, no, Vivian. no, I'm sorry. Um uh, you're talking about family matters all of a sudden? No, 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 oh. no, no. Oh, that's family's matter. Oh my god! Oh my god! Because there was a there's an aunt and yeah that's family. Aunt Rachel. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my aunt god. Rachel stayed around, but then they wrote off the little girl. They they wrote off one of the daughters. Yeah. They did. Judy. Yeah. We used to make fun of Judy. Why? Just because like we would make jokes like, you Who's no longer weird? exist. Like oh my, my high school god. friends. Like oh you no longer exist. You're like Judy from Family oh, Matters. I, I am Stefan. You're Steve Urkel. That's I'm fine. Stephon. Yeah. Um, no, one episode that I really remember enjoying watching of Fresh Prince is when, um, oh shoot, what's her name? This is the older sister. Hillary. Hillary uh, was getting engaged and she was to like the perfect man. Oh yeah, she was obsessed with Trevor. Trevor. <gasps> and no, <laughs> not that episode. I know you. Oh. And then he went skydiving to propose and no. then there was an accident. Was it skydiving or bungee jumping? One it was one of those. those. Yeah. yeah. That may, that convinced me to never do anything extreme. <laughs> Why did they have to go that route? That that was pretty morbid for a comedy, if you think about it. Yeah. And Vivian did have another kid, a little boy. Yes, it was a little boy. It so says, Mark, you would say James Urkel, meanie, right? Did you guys watch any American TV show from start to pilot and then finale? Ooh. 
maybe i don't think i watched ever yeah. only, like friends i probably watch every episode only because dude they oh, like run. jam that down our throat in syndication like that was that was the show to watch from 11 to 12 o'clock when you live in like Orange County area, like Channel Five. Oh, at night. Yeah, yeah. That's how you, you saw the episode. Oh, in high school, like I didn't sleep early, you know. So yeah. that was always fun. I just joined. Amelia says, but I want to see James and Mark video on crab legs. Yeah, we've done maybe like seven or eight crab leg videos. So hopefully, those will get you through until we do our next one. Our, I think our last, our last. Film mukbang was King Crab Lake Grill. Yeah. And that but that was a while ago, but still that was our last yeah. one. Ooh. I felt like she got changed even well before the last season. I could be wrong though. Ooh. Uh Aunt Vivian. Or was she only the last season that got changed? Well, I thought it was like see after season one. Yeah. So we just added rice. <laughs> KU WJC says, I'm so glad I got off early. Hey, Booze. Hey, welcome. What's up? Elda has the whole DVD collection of friends. But here's the thing that I remember I was really bothered. Oh, you always talk about I this. Because like, we, like, the people that we hire at work now, they're getting younger and younger, right? So we just, when they get hired, we usually do like a meet and greet. Yeah. And then uh, I don't know why, but we're talking about sitcoms okay and then i mentioned friends and they're like oh yeah i've heard of that but i've never seen oh, it that i thought you were going to talk about how they made the actresses not wear bras oh on purpose on purpose yeah but i bet you it was just like a yeah a sticker that make it look like the yeah boy, you know? yeah uh joshua is trying to get us to show said nipples on the stream. He says, you guys need more alcohol in your system. Cheers. Thank How you. about if I just unbutton one more? Uh... Yeah, now you're borderline like, you know. Oh, no. I was originally going to button it only here, but um, I went to H Mart. So I was like, oh, I should just do one more. Am I allowed to take a bite of this? Take a bite. Okay, Thank you, ready? Josh. You didn't even know what I was going to take a bite of. Sunday. Ew, your Sunday? <laughs> Thank you, Josh. Thank you. Please. We gotta play a game, but we still owe two shots. And then I finished my four. You did all four already? I think so yeah. I still owe two. Because uh um, look. But that's not that's not two shots there. Are you sure? No, we had to do four. We had to do four. I've only done two of the four. How many of the four have you done? You did four out of the four? Maybe three then. I Can someone do, corroborate? I did do a few more shots while you are like. <laughs> Maybe I had a headache. Mm -hmm. Oh, I love Johnny It's good noodles, with the rice. But the rice is good too, huh? Yeah. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh. This is our last rice, so we don't have any more rice. It's okay. Uh, Bell King Car, we actually have kimchi on the side. I don't know if people add kimchi straight to something like this. It kind of would defeat the purpose, in my opinion. Because we want something cold and fresh and crunchy. Eggs would be good, but we've already put away the burner. <laughs> Honey Carp says, wow. And Randy Jameson says, hey, what's up? Thank you guys for hanging out with us this Friday evening. Hope you're all doing well, and if you're enjoying what you're seeing, hit that subscribe button. Mm. Gochugaru. Oh, I do like adding gochugaru yeah. to my jalimu, but we didn't do that today. And you guys, get ready. After we finish eating, we're going straight into the game segment for the evening. And we want you to play with us because yeah. it's more fun. Yeah. I mean, if no one clicks on the link, that's okay. We'll still play. We'll still play a few we'll rounds. Still play, but we actually have more fun when you join us. And there's prizes. It's like the easiest way to way to win prizes because there's not that much competition. Cell phones ruin movies. It's so much for, more fun when there was cell. Uh, there was phone booths. Did I read that right? Mm. 
I don't think younger people these days would even know how to use a phone booth. We went somewhere recently that had a phone where you had to prepay for it. What was it? Was it Japan? <gasps> remember in Japan, there was a phone booth and we had to use it for some reason to make reservations somewhere. Do you remember that now? We made reservations here. I no, I know, but once we got there, we had to call somewhere very specific while well, we were in Japan and the phone was like either pink or yellow and it was in a phone booth and we were like confused on how to use it. Does this sound like I feel like you're slowly remembering it, but I don't remember it vividly, but I remember it. that's the last time we encountered a phone booth and we felt intimidated to use it. Were we drunk? That I don't remember. I don't think so. Because then how come I'm having a, like when you're saying it more and more, like it's slowly coming back, but it's not there yet. Yeah. Why well, did we, yeah. I don't that's know. why I don't know why we used it. Yes, I think we are going to be playing categories tonight. And then if you're like, what is that? We will tell you exactly how we play that. And Randy, we are eating black bean sauce rice. It was noodles, but now it is rice. It has seafood. It has pork. Um, did you ever play with bombu as a kid? What do you mean play it? Like use the phone? Mm, I don't think so. You did? Tell me, walk me through how one plays with the phone because that's bizarre to me. Like, or I've never heard of it. Well, because I, I think it was middle school that um, uh, my mom made me after school, like stay at the public library for like three hours before I get to go home. Okay. <laughs> Do my homework or whatever, you know, before going home. That's where you met all your girlfriends. But once you finish your homework, there's not much you could do at the library. So I remember, like, we played hide and seek with my friends, and the like. The librarian probably really hated us if I think about it. But anyway, so that library in front of the library, there's a phone booth. And, you know, we didn't want to spend money on quarters, but so we would call random 1-800 numbers. And and then and talk to them like oh hello who is you know like what what eight hundred numbers were available back then for you guys to call just one eight hundred and then we just press random numbers to see if it worked interesting and sometimes it worked oh L and we did call a one eight hundred number that uh, I don't remember the number but it was Wally the Bear <laughs> and when you call this one eight hundred Wally the Bear number like it's this pre recorded voice. And this is where my voice comes from because you heard me do this before. Yeah, let me. Well, I'm closing my eyes to hear what you imitated. <clears throat> Hello, you called Wally the Bear, and then he gives random, like, tips or advice for kids. So this sounds like Wally the Bear. I, is he still around? Probably. And it's an eight one eight hundred number too. No, you're making me think of. Those bots on AIM, AOL Instant Messenger, that you could talk to and they like message you back. But I forget the name of those people. So that Wally the Bear is basically a you evolved version of that. Yeah. Well, you you don't get to talk to. It's just all pre recorded. Oh, you just but listen each to it. day. Yeah. It has different advice to give. But you're like literally paying like thirty five cents per call to do that. No, one eight hundred is free. <gasps> you, that's why you don't have to put in quarters. Oh. That's why we went to one eight hundred random number. One eight hundred random number. <laughs> I just feel like I'm fascinated to learn about your life, um, BJ, before James. That didn't sound. That was an unfortunate acronym. BJ. <laughs> that was an unfortunate acronym, but you know what I mean, right? Amelia, thank you so much for joining us on our live. Have a good night. Uh, when you had to pay for text messages too, or wait until 9 p.m. <gasps> 9 oh. p.m. for free call. I totally forgot yeah, about that. Yeah. It's like I got like, bro, I can call you right now. I'll wait till nine and then I'll hit you up. It was, it was always it was like they only give you like 100 minutes for the month. Yes. Except for when you do the late night calls. It was like that for um or uh what do you call it? The mobile to mobile. Not um, there's a word for it. 
when you call within your own yeah. network, it was also free. It wasn't called mobile to mobile? It was called mobile to mobile? I think so. Oh. T-Mobile, their name is smart. This is like mobile. I don't know. Kevy Do, that is exactly who I was referencing. Smarter Child on AIM. Oh. That was the name of the screen name that you would have on there. And anytime you message them, they, it, they're basically like the Alexa of AOL Instant Messenger, Smarter Child. Mm -hmm. Isn't that funny? We are aging ourselves. Cha Cha 21 says, do cooking for your next video. Like cook a stream for your next video and then let your fans pick your ingredients, copy and paste if you agree. Well, Be Belkingar might have said that originally in Cha Cha copied it. We were supposed to at one point do a video where we tell you guys all the ingredients ahead of time oh, and yeah. then we cook together, but <clears throat> it, we it's hard. It's hard. Or we have a lot of ingredients and then people tell us <sighs> Ew, what to do. no. I can't we've done we've done very like basic iterations of that back in the day. Like I would have two pasta sauces. I would, oh, I would have yeah, two yeah. pastas, but I would make sure it was always like within reason. Like I don't want to add something like crazy in there. And then it's like, I don't want to yeah. eat it, you know? Right. We Public, still want to make good food. Yes. You have to enjoy it, right? Public phones cost 10 cents to make. A pack of six cost 40 cents. And that was actually pretty, actually penny candy. That's how cheap things were back in the day. Cigarettes used to be that cheap. Well, now they add all these taxes to it. Yeah. But I had a dream that I smoked a pack of cigarettes last night. What? It did it happen in real life? It didn't happen in real life. No but wonder your voice like at work. No, you, like, but <laughs> just think, think, think to what happened yesterday, and then I realized that's why I had that dream. You see? Yeah. yeah. That's why I was like, but in the dream it was very intense, like. It was like a marble, Marlboro. Marlboro. I was going to town. I was like, "What? Who am I?" So, uh, my dad smoked a lot, mm -hmm. and um, and back then, Marlboro had like if you collect kind of like kids, but then it's for adults. I don't know. But oh, what do you collect? You have to cut like the barcode of each pack, whatever, mm. and then each pack was worth like X amount of points. That you could redeem and they had their own catalog of like jackets and duffel bags or just random but it was marlboro branded stuff mm -hmm. um but my mom you know she's a housewife so she might be like bored or whatever she collected all those like points or whatever and we and we are, we ordered like duffel bags and jackets and stuff and they're good quality, but, but I remember in my fifth grade camping trip. Did you get scolded I, for it? I, I mean, because the double back, it was red, but it was really good quality. Yeah, but yeah. it has the Marlboro logo on it. So I remember the teacher was like, what? <laughs> That's a very interesting double back. But I was all proud about it. You're cute. Yeah. I'm so cute. Your mom just wanted you to have a nice bag. Yeah. You gotta go camping? I'm jealous. I never gotta go camping as a kid. I think we even wore Marlboro jackets. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine though? It's like, all right, s'mores time, and then you take out your cigarette. <laughs> Give me what another was, shot. Give me another what shot. Was, I what I don't, most people thought like I don't I did know, as girl. A kid, I don't. But they're good quality, like windbreaker yeah. jackets. I'm seeing a lot of questions in the chat about MySpace. How let's let's just go off that topic for a second. How how deep were you in the MySpace business? I, I had an account. Was I, I ever in your top eight? I don't think so. I don't think we were knew each other. I, I did because your profile picture was you in this white T-shirt. and You were like this on MySpace. Yeah. And I know you were on my MySpace because I said I was straight on there, and then somehow you told me later on like. Oh, you said you're straight on there, so I gave up. Or something like that. Didn't you give up? But then you also knew, right? You didn't know. You kind of gambled on me. Because I, I for like, me, I, for the sexual orientation, I would just not I'll answer, answer, answer it at all. Oh. That was my way of saying that I was gay. Without having this come out. Interesting strategy. I just said straight and it stopped you from pursuing me. It should have. Um, I, I, 
did have Friendster. I did have Friendster. I had Friendster. Friendster had a lot of potential, but they just, but Friendster, if you think about it, it reminds me of LinkedIn today, but like, like, like more professional based, but Friendster gave me more of that LinkedIn vibe. No, I love Friendster, but I think that was just more about UCI. Like, I don't know, like the people that we were with started off with Friendster, but somehow randomly Facebook came along after that. Yeah. And I'm like, Facebook, why would you sign up for Facebook? Cause it looks exactly like Friendster. It did have a very similar layout. It was. I was like, and but then more, more and more people like across the country use Facebook than Friendster. Yeah. Well, do you remember we were we were old enough to have used Facebook when it was only for colleges. At the very beginning, it was only for colleges. You mean Facebook? Sorry, did I say Friendster? Yeah. Okay. No. You, yeah. Do you know. even know what I said? You I know say, what I'm you thinking. You didn't say Facebook, but yeah, it was only for. Yeah, college. it was only for Facebook. Facebook was only for college oh, students yes. initially, and then they expanded it. Um, Kami Young says, my dad got a marble sleeping bag as oh well. Oh my God, Eddie, do you know what I'm talking about? <gasps> you guys are hilarious. They have a catalog of stuff that you order, the more you smoke. <laughs> um, Joshua was very deep back in the day with MySpace. I used to make my own backgrounds and everything. How about music? Did you embed music in there? I was very deep with Zynga. I made my own banner on Photoshop. I I mean, I just love reading this. Um, Brenda also had a marble duffel bag I took to school too. <laughs> what? What? What is, it? is it only the Koreans that knew to redeem? I mean, how good is a set bag? Let's Google this afterwards. And we should just buy one if there's one available just for nostalgic stuff. Yeah, we might have to find it on eBay now. <laughs> Uh, Julie says, rolling your jeans at your ankle, it left dense. Did you ever do that? I don't think so. I don't remember rolling up my jeans. I, really, I remember because that break dance that school did that. But it was only the kids that did the break dancing. I had baggy jeans, like super baggy. Yeah. Like they're wide leg jeans. And then I would also cut Oh, like a slit? A slit to flare it out. I never did. I was so cool. Yeah, yeah you believe that. That's fine. <laughs> I don't, I just don't know. <gasps> yeah, I like cutting the bottom of your jeans up, you know, with a slit. Yeah. I did that. Elle is bringing back the memories of the first pager. Actually, I think someone earlier in the chat mentioned um, loving to have to record songs in order to hear them again. Like literally, you have to listen to the radio station, wait till the disc jockey stops talking, and then press record to get the song. But on sometimes cassette. I get annoyed when they talk during the beginning. Yeah, the and then it ruins it. I never did that though. DJ Jojo, you're stupid. <laughs> oh, Jojo on the radio. Jojo oh my god, I totally radio. forgot about him. <laughs> wow, we are going down memory lane. I think so. You guys are like taking us there. Are you sure you want to go down this route? Uh, we did play Maple Story, Hannah, but I don't think either of us ever played Sims. I played Sim City, but never played the Sims. I uh, b remember buying Sim City, yeah. and I think I didn't really know how to play, and then I got really frustrated and I stopped playing. Games. Sounds that sounds like your normal life cycle <laughs> with any video game. Wait, so Susan is the one from San Francisco, but Danyang was. Yeah. And she, she wrote it in Korean, right? Yeah. Totally. Because she says, my dad also ordered marble gear too. What? <laughs> I, what is this? I'm so proud because I thought, like, I no. totally forgot that. You have a whole community memory. of this. And I don't know why. Well, because it only came up because James just said he last night he dreamt that he smoked a pack of cigarettes. And somehow my brain went to i don't even remember if you had asked me yesterday i would have said oh yeah it, it, i had the double but i don't know but for whatever reasons i just talked about it and then i feel like there's a whole community of support for me michael met on a gay dating website called gaydar even though we are both in montreal quebec canada canada well whatever works were you trying to find your Prince William or Prince Harry? We never used apps. You did? I'll tell you later. <laughs> this is not this is not for you to find James on Tinder. 
I would really use Tinder. Oh, Grinder. Probably Grinder. Yeah. Get straight to the point. You know? No wonder you're really good at swiping things. I don't swipe things. When did swiping things even became a thing, huh? Tinder. How many years ago was that? Five, six years ago. All right. Well, we didn't do the game portion yet, so we should clear that out really quick. Yeah. Get that I'm squared cool. away. I, we, I still need to take one more shot, and then I think I'm caught up. I so I, I, I regret how much food I ate. We ate all the noodles and then some more with the rice. But neither of us ate breakfast, and we had a very light lunch. I had, I had a couple noodles. That's pretty Ooh, good. girl. Yeah, I always eat that. I know. <laughs> why should I have girl? Okay, I'll have this first. You know, while I do this, just for better planning, I'm going to drop the link in the chat mm -hmm. so you guys have some time to decide if you want to jump in and participate. Well, dinner was so good. I just had a bite right now. Yeah. It's so good. It was good. Actually, now that I think about it, um, I don't feel as heavy as what I normally think of when I eat jajajamian outside. But it, maybe it's it because we eat like tangs, we eat like yeah. tangsu, we eat mandu, we eat all these other we, things. We get kampong seu, which is the um, oh, spicy so chili shrimp. We always get yaki mandu, which is like the deep fried mandu that's like this big. Yeah. Are we clearing the butcher paper too? Yeah, because it's unsightly. Look how easy cleanup is. Which reminds me of the commercial for foil, like Reynolds foil. Reynolds. Reynolds. Uh, they look like house moms in a scientist coat jacket. They're house moms, but they look like a scientist. And, oh, that sounds, yeah. I and then the whole picture is like you layer things with foil so that cleanup is easy. Mm. Yeah. So what we just did right now reminds me of that commercial. All right, so here's your paper. So while you guys are deciding if you want to join the game, we can do a test round so people can get a feel, especially if this is your first time, you're like, what's going on? The way it works is we play a game with, called Scategories. I'm going to share my screen. Uh, and then if you win, then you are entered into so you, a drawing. So regardless, if you participate, you get entered in the drawing. Oh, yeah. If you win against us, you get, you get another, an extra. Yeah, yeah. another uh, chance. So this is what it's on. We like this so people could see that. So the way it works is we have a letter here, G, and there's going to be 10 categories revealed. And you need to think of words that fit in that category. Uh, but you want to make sure you think of something that fits the category, but might not be so common that the other person would guess it. Right. If you come up with a unique answer, you get a point. If you somehow come up with a word that is like a two-part word that both start with the letter G, like, I can't even think no, of one. No, if, if there's a repeat answer, then we have to cancel it. No, I'm talking about how to get double points. Oh, like, like let's say the answer was Mickey Mouse and the letter was M, you would get double points for that. You get two points. There's two words, two words in that. Answer with that letter. So we're going to do a test run, but we hope that there's someone who is willing to play with us. Play with us. We have, how do you join the game? Well, all you need to do is click on the link. If you're on your phone, you, you just have to turn on your camera and, and mic, and it'll just ask you before you do it. Uh, 18 and over. Yes. Unless you're with your. Uh, parent yeah. or legal guardian. We, we've been very nice about the minor thing. So if you look really young, just take it as a compliment that we don't let you in. <laughs> right? All right. So let's do the first round. And then hopefully by the time we finish this, this is two minutes, uh, someone will have joined this. Uh, so just watch us play if you want to know how to play. Yeah. But we do want you to click on the link. All right. You, oh, let me yeah number it first. And then for this round, just for stakes, I think I have to take one more shot. Are you caught up on shots then? I think so. Okay. I, I so, took this whole bottle by myself. No, you didn't. Okay, don't. I you didn't. Like did. You feel, but you didn't. And so what we're going to do is for this round, okay. whoever loses has to take another shot. But, okay. So don't lose. <laughs> you, you have fear in your eyes. Have more confidence. You actually, 
No, I think oh. it's because we owe. We owe one more for me. If you are no, we up. owe finishing this bot. Remember? Oh, we regardless. Were down Four shots. But you said you took the four when I was only at two, so I don't know how I have to replay the tape. I think I did four. <gasps> so this is that's two. one shot? Or I just have no, to finish two. that. Because you did two. So you need to drink two. I thought I did three, and this last one was gonna be my one to Kata. Whatever. You are inflated. Fine. Do you not want to play for drinks? Just play for Momos? Uh, oh chummy chummy nipples. No, we can play for shots. Okay, fine. We're going for shots. That's fine. Okay, you guys ready? Set. Oh, G. G. Ready, set, go. Acronyms. Acronyms? That starts. Sports equipment. Things that have spots. Oh no, you got that. Acronyms. Things that make you smile. Things on a beach. I'm never go to the beach. What's at the beach? I have a clear a sand castle, clams, hermit crabs. I can't think. I'm gonna skip that one. Seven things that make you smile. <laughs> uh, something you're afraid of. Something you're afraid of. Gifts and presents. Sports. Gifts and presents. Sports what equipment. Else is there? What can I give as a gift that starts with a G? Sports equipment. Things on a beach. Gifts and presents. Things on the beach. Things on the beach. Oh, time's up. Oh my god, you filled yours out too? <gasps> you did too. I just did at the very last second. We got a couple people in the waiting room. You guys stick, sit tight. We are going to get to you guys in a moment. Thank you so much. Oh, turn your sound on too. Or does the what sound? have sound or no? No. Would the timer go off? Oh, oh no, it just ends. Okay, okay. so perfect. We're going to go over these really quickly. We'll be really quick. Okay, so number one, well, we can kind of go at the same time, right? So number one was sports equipment, gym bag. I would gun for the, you know, the- Yeah, sure. okay. what's that called, skating? Yeah. Yeah. Why do, you, why, do you, why do you look so unsure? Okay. Flowers? Flowers, I wrote geranium. I would, a golden poppy. Yeah. Oh. Is that there one called a gerbera? Gerbera? I don't really know a lot of flowers. Yeah. Presidents. I thought you were going to write George Washington. <gasps> so I did I something wrote, different. I did something different. Oh, I hope it's not the same one. It's going to be the same one. Go. Gerald Ford. Dang it. No. Oh, it doesn't matter. God. We're both. It's just us two. So it's okay. 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 Uh, acronyms. No one's going to know but me. It's yeah. called GRIP. But only the reason why I know is because remember I was on a panel. Yeah. Uh, moderator. Yeah. The uh, Andy works for a program called Grip. Okay. Okay. What does it stand for? Uh, so there's two Grip programs. One is a gang reduction in something in okay. prison. Oh. But this one, uh, I forgot. That's yeah. fine. I wrote GSN, Game Show oh, Network. Oh, okay. So yeah. you you're giving me the point for Grip? Yeah, it's oh, a, okay. it's an actual acronym, right? Okay. Things you find at a beach. Yeah. Girls. I wrote glass. So what kind of glass? Like broken glass shards in the sand. Oh. Okay. Technically, that's... girls are not things, but that's when you're really technical. Things are person, place, or thing. So that usually you don't count that, but we're not that we're not being sticklers tonight. Oh. So it's okay. All right. Next one. Spot. Things that have spots. Giraffes. I wrote giraffes. No. Okay. 
Things uh, that make you smile. Things that make you smile. Okay. I wrote grin. Like when so someone else grinning. grinning. Okay, yeah. Smile. I wrote gold. See, I was gonna write gold too, but I'm like, okay, that's fine. Dude, that make a smile, but whatever. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Things at a bar. I wrote gin. I wrote Guinness. Okay. Wait, it's hard with just two. We're probably gonna play. Okay. I think we're gonna. Okay, number nine. nine. Things that scare you. Ghosts. I wrote a Grim Reaper. Okay. And then gifts or presents. I wrote gold necklace. I wrote gun. <laughs> I mean, we wouldn't give a gun, but like that's a gift. So then are we just tied? We're, we're just tied. Okay, so we just done then, right? Yeah. All right. So I'm going to drop the link again. You guys, this is your chance to join in. Number six, my daughter said grandpa. Things with spots, Grandpa. That is so <laughs> cute. With their sunspots on. Oh, no. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to drop games for gifts. Yes. I'm dropping the link again. And we have our first player. Yeah. So let's welcome a familiar face to the street. Oh, Mr. Guapo. Hi. Hi. Happy Friday. Happy Friday. Happy Friday. I see you're representing with your jacket. I know you're still in your work I gear. Been. I just got home. <laughs> Did oh. you have dinner yet? I know you usually have late dinners. No, I didn't eat. Are you planning to? You're gonna do this thing? Yeah, I, I plan on. I plan to eat, but oh, good. Are you gonna home. eat something that you already have at home, or are you gonna go out and pick up something? Most likely, probably something we already have. Oh, mm. so that's good. Save money. <laughs> All right. So Josh is no stranger to our stream, but really quickly, uh, for people that don't know you, answer these three questions. Where are you from? What's your favorite food? And how did you find us? Okay. So um, favorite food stuff. would have to be Filipino food. Um, I found you guys after watching the, um, while well, my mom, we, we were eating kare kare and I was looking up like mukbangs for people who are eating it, and I think you guys were making it. Oh, oh you that saw you oh, that, that video? video? I didn't even know that. Uh -huh. I didn't know that. Then, I was so buzzed with that video because I had happy hour at work, and then I was so buzzed that night. Oh my gosh, making kind of kind of buzz. Um, I'm from like I'm from Norwalk, borderline Cerritos. Awesome. All right, so Josh. You know how the game works. We're, we're gonna pull up the little screeny here, and we're gonna come up with a new uh, letter and new categories. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay. All right, ready. I'm gonna do restart. We got two letters. Oh, you the letters M. Your favorite. The right mark for everything. Okay, ready, set, Ooh. go. This is hard. School supplies. Names used in song. I like that one, but I don't know. Vegetables? Oh. The screen just went black. Uh-oh, you can't see it? Wait, let me pause it. Can you hear us? Uh-oh, we can't hear you anymore. Oh no, we can't hear you. We see, we can we see, see you. you. Well, we paused it, so. I, the last thing we heard you say was that the screen went black. Did you charge your phone? <laughs> Did you run out of battery? No, this is kind of fun because now this is another game. We're trying to figure out what Josh is saying. We could read your lips. Go ahead and say what you want to say. 
<laughs> I don't know. <laughs> well, your lips move really fast. Yeah, today. like if we can't hear you. Do you want to exit out real quick and then come back? Oh yeah, uh, just try that real quick before we. Yeah. And you guys, if you haven't yet, consider clicking on that link. Sure to uh, retype the. We got Prissy P who joined the chat. Oh, welcome, Prissy P and Lou. Welcome. Oh, did I never chat it? There we go. It's the whisper challenge now, right? The oh my god, M was hard. Well, you can't think of any more, right? I can't even think of any because I don't even know what's I don't, left. Yeah, I don't remember. All right, let's add Josh back to the stream. How's that? Is that better? Yeah. Can you guys hear me? Yeah, can you, can you see it? Okay. Yeah. Okay, we're 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 back online. So we just paused it. I'm gonna continue. It's just pressing play again, right? Okay, okay ready, set, go. Probably would have been better off not coming back because I <laughs> this is bad. This is hard. Since you quit your job. Things you do every day. Maze. School supplies. Things you throw away. Uh, Things. What do you throw vegetables, away every day? Vegetables. Vegetables. Um, can you pick up a cabbage? Can you pick up a cucumber? Things you throw away. Cab. Oh. Okay. oh, oh! Time is up. Time is up. Oh my gosh. Okay, this Josh, you go first. This was hard. So, okay, so think you throw things away. You throw away. Um, I just put makeup. I don't know. I wrote some makeup. Wrote what? Okay. Yeah. Sometimes when the makeup gets crusty or dry, you just throw it away. But that's what you thought of. I couldn't think of anything else you throw away. Okay. But, well, that cancels I'm out. Like you and Josh have the same brain. Great minds think alike. You know. Yeah. Should I just go mine too? Uh, should, oh should yeah, yeah we could just time. do. Yeah. So what did I you wrote say? Wrote money. It's oh, a, it's a saying. I hey, guess you do throw away like, money, yeah. Like if we're, uh, if you're spending a lot of money, you know, on useless things, it's a phrase. Oh, okay. You just throw money away. Yeah. So I was being creative. That makes sense. Vegetables. So vegetables. I was thinking like along Filipinos. So I was like maybe a mango bean. Oh, I've never had it, but if that's a vegetable, I ain't gonna. I think I heard of it before. Yeah. Is it good? They come in bags. They're like dried and then oh. you eat it in a dish called like mungo. All right. You get that. I wrote mustard greens. You wrote mustard greens? I wrote mustard greens. Okay. Then I. <gasps> I thought I was going to get this point yeah. too because I wrote this at the last minute. Okay. No. I'm sorry about it. All right. Number three was footwear, I think. Yeah. What'd you write, Josh? I didn't, I didn't get anything. I wrote moccasins. I wrote mo What? Get out of my brain. This one, I had to really think a lot. Well, you we're just paving a path for Josh to get victory. That's oh, fine. Gosh, okay, All right, four. Notorious People. Nope. I wrote Michael Jackson. I wrote Mike Tyson. They're both notorious, okay? We okay. get a point for that. Uh, number five, was it Europe? Europe Places place? in Europe. Places in Europe? What'd you guys get? Because I didn't get anything. I wrote Munich. I wrote, oh, oh, are you serious? You wrote Munich? I wrote Munich. What other places starts with an M in Europe? Yeah, I can't think of anything else but Munich. I don't know. Madrid? Oh, that would have been a good one, Madrid. Manchester? Manchester. Dang it, all these other ones coming out. Oh. Okay, well, we didn't get a point for that. Um, reasons you would leave your job or quit your job for number six? I put moving. Oh, that's, oh a good that's a good one. one. People always do that. I wrote more pay somewhere else. I wrote money. Are those different, Josh, or do you want to veto that? No, you it's the same reason, but we did write different words. 
Right, it's the same thing, but it's okay. Oh, you're so anyway. nice. Oh, uh, it's okay. I'm going to lose All anyway. Right. I only got three answers. <laughs> I only, got th- I only have three points too. Yeah, so far I only have two. Number seven, things you do every day. No, I, I wrote dinner. I wrote move. <laughs> yeah, you do move every day. <laughs> All right. Uh, Cindy's answer for reasons to uh, quit your job is making out with worker. Is that from experience? Oh, or? I want to know more. <laughs> yeah, we're going to table about that. Number eight is school supplies. Yeah. No, I wrote marker. I wrote marker. You would. It has your name in it. All right, song. Uh, word names. Songs that have names in it. Negative. No. I wrote Maria. I wrote Mary. Dang. What's your song? You have to sing five seconds of it. Mary had a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. Mary had a little lamb. And the Wool was white as snow. That I don't was good. I Is that like, what's Maria? Maria, you gotta see ya. <laughs> da, 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 da. If Elle's still here, then it's Maria, Maria, Maria. Maria. I was also thinking of sound of music, Maria. Oh, how, how's that one go? <laughs> like Maria. Oh, yeah, that's a good one. Yeah. Anyways. All right, and then number ten was birds. Oh, I don't know if this is a bird. I wrote, yeah. I wrote mockingbird. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah. Don't say you wrote mocking jay. No, I wrote mongoose. I think <laughs> that's a lizard. I think about, isn't a mongoose a I bird? Don't, I don't know what a mongoose. A mongoose is. is a lizard, isn't it? Oh, now I don't know. I don't know. But it has. I think a mongoose is a lizard. We're gonna we're gonna leave it up to the chat to confirm that oh, one. Goose. Mark is also looking it up. Doesn't a mongoose oh, no. isn't a mongoose a predator against a snake, right? Oh, it's, that does not look like a bird at all. You're but, right, Josh. But it's cute. Is it looks like a ferret? It oh looks like God, a oh, it is so cute. cute. Yeah, kind of looks like a honey badger. Well, maybe it's not a lizard. <laughs> Oh yeah. Well, well, it's definitely not a bird. No, you're right. So. The mongoose versus the cobra snake. Yeah, and it's it's it. Oh, why is that snake spitting so much? Mm. <laughs> All right. So I got one, two, three, four, five. I got five. I got three. I All got, right. I got five. Well, Josh, here's here's the deal. You're the only one that's participated so far. So we're gonna. Open it up for maybe like three or four more minutes. And then if no one else joins in, then you automatically win the prize for today. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Those are good odds, right? It's like even it's better than playing the lottery. It's like automatic win. But you we really get Elda on here. On. Elda. Say that again. I said Elda's got to get on here. Well, we've been telling Elda. She's camera shy, I think. So it's okay. I'm Like I said, I'm dropping the link again. We're going to let you figure out your dinner sitch, okay? Okay. And then if you end up winning, we know how to find you. So, okay. Thanks for joining. Thanks for having me. Happy Friday. Have a great weekend Happy and Friday. stay Thanks. Bye. Oh, it's going to rain tomorrow. Are you working tomorrow? I hope it rains all weekend. Oh, oh you like you like you, the rain? Are you are you working tomorrow? No, I'm off. Oh, oh good. Yeah. It's All right. Have right. a wonderful weekend. Yeah. Thank you. Like, you know. Tomorrow, should we like drive somewhere to get a free car wash? Yeah, we could do that. Don't we? Sometimes we like park our car like outside. <laughs> yeah. Elda, how about this? We will make a concession for you. You don't have to appear on camera, but we at least need to hear your voice. So th- there's no excuse now, right? Elsa's Elda, you're beautiful. See, we all support each other around here. There are so many people we've never met um, via chat. This is your chance to just hop on, play along. Even if you don't want to play along, you just want to say hello. That's okay, too. But let's let's give an official time. So I'm going to give three minutes starting now before anyone can enter. If not, Joshua will win the $15 gift, gift card, card to, to Amazon. Amazon. You could buy a lot with $15. Oh. Oh, this is, oh, James, that's even worse. I hate my voice. 
So do you want to come on camera and do the thing that Josh did where we can't hear audio oh, and you just have to read your lips? lips. So I feel the headache went away. Oh, good. But I what have to take one more. <laughs> Dang it. Right when I said that, you thought the same exact thing. Like, I'll, I'm going to make sure the headache comes back. No, I, think, I think this is yours. Fine, I'll drink it. No, no, you have to drink it. Okay. Baby, don't drink it. Oh, I should. <gasps> magpie is a bird. Oh, darn it. Chummy, that logo is a magpie? I thought it was. I, thought it was. I don't know what a magpie is. I thought, no, magpie is a bird. If you ever, if you told me what's a magpie, I'd be like a savory dessert. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, I did, I've did. i never heard of a magpie. It's a bird. Yeah. Oh, darn it. I was like, I, why didn't I write, write mongoose? Mon because the word goose in it. <sighs> Woo! A lot of people have been complimenting. I haven't read them out loud, but so many people have complimented the shirt that you're wearing tonight. Oh, so. I haven't seen any. Yeah, I've, this is the third one, I think. Third or fourth one. Thank you, Lou. This is so comfortable, too. Do you hear that noise? Yeah, what was that? The way the liquid came down my throat. Oh, what? Why does this hurt right here? I feel like I got another flu shot. Uh oh. It's not red. It's right here. It's, I feel like it's bruised. You didn't fall or anything. Oh, my body's falling apart. Josh, that happens in real life. When there's no pressure, I can think of all the answers. We have people telling that all the time. Like, they'll not be on it, and then they can think of everything. And then as soon yeah, as they come who on. was it? They're like, it's so easy. But then when they finally came on, <laughs> they couldn't even think of a word. Yeah, I don't was know. It I forgot. All right. This is your minute and a half warning. Last minute and a half. And then uh, get your Amazon card. But you know what? Joshua could win too. Yeah. You know? Thank you. It's so she says, um, my snapback looks good on me. Oh, your hat? Back. Yeah. You yeah. know? Yeah. Do, how much cleaning do we have to do? Uh, it's not that bad. I think. Oh, we, but we have to. Um, I hate when I'm beginning to do the dishes, but then the dishwasher is full of clean dishes. Oh yeah, that's right? true. Yeah, oh, that's the worst feeling. We have to unload the um, dishwasher. Sydney says, "I feel the same way. I'm not photogenic, and at all, and my voice is so nasally. I don't particularly like the sound of my voice. I." <laughs> I hate my voice too. But you can just come on here. Where are you safe space? Margie, you need to enunciate. Enunciate. I'm like, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Gah. Gah. Oh, stop that. That's that's enough. <laughs> and and Joshua, that is true. He said, Where's Sean and Tom or Kemu Young? You know, they're 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 taking a step aside, and we only have 25 more seconds for someone to click on set to like, two. No, I don't, not today. Mm -hmm. I'm okay. You don't want a butterfly tattoo? No, I'm okay. I'm not. Uh, June is at his mother, so I'm here alone. Love my future husband's mother and family. That's great. I don't know how to draw a butterfly. Is this a butterfly? L, that's exactly where he Ooh. got it from. It looks He's, like a nasty part. She said, ew. <laughs> Mark, you got away. It worked for Am Jung Hwa. So, yeah. All right, we we got a last minute oh. submission, so we're gonna let because I think there was some there is a slight delay, so we're gonna let them come on, and then if not, is this a I don't know who that, is it is it the person that we know or is it a different person? We have no idea because their camera's not on and they left. They left. So, they got scared. So that's okay. We're so, never gonna do this game again. So Joshua wins. Congratulations, Joshua. Yeah. So yeah. Oh yeah. High five. You. you I felt like I won. Okay, so Kemu Young is here just for funsies, I guess. Wait, Let's... were you trying to join in a second ago, Ed? Oh, we can't talk. He can't talk to us right now. Well, let's add him. Maybe, maybe he was. Were Jeff. you Jeff? That was not me earlier. That was not you earlier. Yeah. Well, so like, here, here's the deal. Joshua's already won, but we can play for fun. Okay. 
How, how's your I Friday mean, going? Why are you wearing? Wondering... Yeah, tell what? us your life story. Why are why are people wearing like jackets and stuff at home? Oh my gosh, it's cold in Oregon. It's like forties, fifties, and you know, he's at the high. Rain. Oh my gosh, it's cold. <laughs> I don't know. I don't wear clothes at home. <laughs> not, like, no, 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 no. Like, hold on, hold on, like, hold on, no, no. I don't layers. Wear, I don't wear like going out clothes at home. Like, I, I would wear a robe or put a blanket around me. Well, this looks like a t-shirt and a hoodie. That's fine. No? Do you wear hoodies at home? I don't. I get hot really easily. Eddie, not knowing Eddie that well, he seems like he could emanate heat. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? It means what it means. Let's not read into it. You know, what, I, you know, I can't so, stay. I can't stay for a game anymore. I gotta go. Hey, we have 143 viewers on. That's symbolic for us loving you. Okay. Are you? Are, are you? Oh, I love when people um, could emit heat during the cold time. Like just cuddle with them, and stay warm. That's nice. Oh God. Well, um, never mind. <laughs> never mind. Eddie seems so over us right now. Well, I'm sorry if we hurt your feelings. No, no, the reason I didn't also log in was because last time you guys gave me so much crap for not paying my internet bill, and I wasn't sure if I'd have a replay of that. So no, but that that was um, that was offline. That was during. That wasn't during the stream. It wasn't. Yeah, but still, you know, it could have. I don't. I didn't want to carry it into your stream. Oh, it was just uh, there are other people involved in that conversation. Not that day. Wait, that You're talking about Halloween, right? I also. Oh, oh yeah, I was Harvey Milk. Yeah, girl, you don't even remember <laughs> what happened. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's been a it's been a long week week and a half i'm very excited for the weekend so do you need to talk about it before we jump into the game or are well, you good your, your parent wait, did you say your parents are here for the weekend no no i'm just very excited for the weekend my parents live i my parents live like 10 minutes away oh, oh that's nice yeah. oh and real quick before we jump into the game marble you also had the marble boro bag Dude, my dad smoked up a storm, and so he, we had stat. We had, I think, you know, like those bank bags that had the zipper, and it was oh, like yeah, the, yeah, it was money. It was yeah. like full of like I don't know those UPC codes or whatever, or like cut. Yeah. I think my mom kept it in that too. Yeah, like some paper bag. Yeah. So and and it what we had a sleeping bag and all this other stuff. The catalog was like sitting on the kitchen table, and I remember thinking, oh, how? What is this? What is happening? And I think I don't know. I was like, part of me is like, Dad, stop smoking, you crazy person. But then my mom was always like, but we can get all these things. It was terrible. <laughs> That's how exactly it was with my mom. Yeah, and then I thought they were good. So. Yeah, I mean but, they're they're a good quality. I think I took the sleeping bag somewhere and being I was like being judged by other people, like thinking I was smoking or something. I but think I all the I think all the Koreans need to just have a support group and just talk about their experience using a Marlboro product like stuff as yeah. a kid. Yeah, that's it could, I guess that could have been traumatizing. Yeah. <laughs> Don't smoke, everyone out there. Don't smoke. No, oh, yeah. yeah. This is yeah. coming from the doctor that says to cure my headache, drink more. Oh yeah, prescribe. Yeah, it's a yeah. I have my prescription pad right here. I'm writing your prescription for more shots. Oh, oh, but you know what's funny is I'll eat my own words. I actually don't have a headache as a result of drinking more. So see, I know what I, I'm talking about. I think I think you're that's why legit. People, that's why people drink Bloody Mary the next morning mm. to cure any hangover from the night before. You need to drink more alcohol. Is that true, Ed? Yes. Mark is also a doctor. You should know. He has a doctorate in his history and um I, his am a... <laughs> I don't I don't know many doctors that need to like flaunt their open button shirts when someone says they're a doctor. 
Oh, you're <laughs> that kind. You're the sexy kind of doctors Doctor that show up those parties. Sexy. Right. Yeah. Okay. Who, I like those. Who needs to get a physical done? What? <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna get into the game. Let's get into okay. that really quick. So I'm gonna, oh, yes. But caveat, you guys are, maybe it's just me, but it's kind of like blurry and choppy. And so if I lose, I blame that. And if I win, it's legitimate. And then are we going back to how your internet bill has not been paid? Look, I pay Wait, my- let's ask the chat. Is it blurry and choppy right now? Because I did yeah. hear that earlier, but I don't know if it's- Are we blurry and choppy? I, I'm yeah. Let's see. You know, other people were saying it was a little blurry earlier. So, me, I don't know. They all see blurry too. You know what? Like, it is choppy. Thank you, Joshua. Turn your head to the left and cough, please. So Mark. we're choppy. What do we do? Okay. Do wait, we let's it? reset the focus. No, choppy. And then now it's focused again. Yes. Well, um, I don't know. Did it improve? Well, this happened on Tuesday during the election. Like, people were watching us, and it was so choppy. And we, we didn't know what to do. We need to figure out how to hardwire our... I mean, our, our Wi-Fi is great, but sometimes it's not reliable-ish. And some YouTube sucks. Bre Brenda says it's your guys' uh, fault for not paying your internet bills. So it's not my fault. We do auto-pay. Maybe we need to pay our credit card bill. Yeah, exactly. Thank you, Mark. I Oh, yeah. Oh, we didn't pay our credit card. We bill. have until the 20th. Maybe you should. No, no. Okay, never mind. <laughs> okay, let's play. Let's go. All right, let's play. Uh, it's this button. Can you at least see the words on your screen? Yeah, yeah, I can. Oh, yeah. So you don't need to see us. Everyone knows what we look like, so you're good. Yeah, All right, I'm going to restart the round. And this one's just for shits and giggles. Okay. Because Joshua already Joshua has been declared the winner. Oh my God, oh, okay. Are yeah. you guys ready for this? M and J. Okay, ready, Sorry, set, man. go. Things found at a hospital? That's not fair. Oh, I got lots of answers for that. And number 10 is items you take on a trip if it's cut off on your screen. Okay. Items you take on a trip. Oh. Things found in the hospital. Things you do at work. <laughs> Things found in a hospital. There has to be a drug that starts with a J. <laughs> oh no! Oh, Two, one. Oh no! I don't, I oh my god! Oh god! Okay. Hey, exercise, Eddie. What do you have? I wrote jazzercise. Oh, oh, clever! I wrote jogging. I wrote jumping jacks for double. No, you were thinking that, but you did something different. No. Oh. No, that's a good one. All right. Oh. Very good. Everyone got points that one. Yay. Number two is fish. I put a John Dory. 
Yeah, I see them cooking that on either like Master Chef or Hell's Kitchen. They always had a John Dury on there. What that's, how I, that's how I know. Yeah. Oh, chicken G Dory. <laughs> Not to be confused not to, with G Dory. Not not to be confused with John Doria. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> what did you write? I don't have anything. I wrote jellyfish. See, I was thinking of that, but I was like, well, uh, that's technically not a fish, but so it has to work. Do you? Right. I mean, I'm okay with it getting well, booted if it's not right. But I will give you the point. Is a jellyfish even a fish? No, it's not. I will, I will, I'll, I'll, I'll turf it to the audience. Yeah, the audience. Do you guys think it's like it's one of those clever answers, but it's it's not natural. Like the word fish is in it, but doesn't it mean it's a fish. Fine. Well, we'll come back to that one. I'm not going to count myself for that yet. Number three okay. is things you do in uh, at work. I wrote juggle tasks. Oh, very good. Wow. What'd you write? I wrote junk email reading. You could just say junk email, like the like. Well, I wanted to make it. sure, like you know, like that we're reading it. You know, I wrote jotting notes. Okay, so everyone gets a point for that one, and I've been officially vetoed for jellyfish. Okay. So I'm gonna go to the Supreme Court about that. <laughs> yeah. Okay, never mind. All right, cross that out. Number four, things found in a hospital. I'm very curious to hear what you have to say, Ed, because I feel like you know like a lot of answers for this one. Well, the first one that came to mind, just because it has the letter J in it, is a J-tube, which is... Uh, Educate a, us. Uh, what part of the body do you use a J-tube on? I can guess, but I don't want to. <laughs> it's basically to help with enteral feedings that it goes into your jejunum, part of your small intestines. So for people who uh, kind of can't eat, and so they'll need a J-tube. Like, I never doubted that you were in the before, but now I'm certain you are. Because you have <laughs> <laughs> or really good, like, what do you call those people that lie so well? <laughs> Mark. Like, they not sound me. legit, but then they're not. Like, I'm, I know it's not con artists, but it's in yeah, that vein. Yeah. Like, they're just so good at lying. Yeah. Yeah. Like, like that one move, Catch Me If You Can with Leonardo oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. and Tom Hanks. Yeah. Yeah, because was didn't he pretend to be a doctor so he had to sound like a doctor? Anyways, I mean we have some clever answers. Cindy says jam copy machine. Oh, for work. Uh, Michael says jealous jerks, and Cindy says janitor. Those are all good J words. I wrote joint juice at the hospital for people with joints. Don't they give them joint That's juice at there? Costco, but I don't think they no. serve that. I know. I, my dad used to drink joint juice from Costco in those little cans. Yeah, the orange <laughs> ones. Yeah, yeah. I have never seen that in a hospital, but you know, I'll give it to you. It's you know. Whatever. I don't know. Okay, if one person is against it, I'm okay with crossing it out. What'd you write? Jello. Jello is really good. That's good. That's, That's good. See, I also I like. Work. I like. Lou Han's answer to junior doctors. I think that's Ooh. Uh, like, do you like literally like junior doctors or the uh, answer? <laughs> I like the answer, you know. Oh. God, come so on. That's why I've always loved about Ed. He just what? goes along with the jokes. Well, you know, I it's I'm on my best behavior right now. And then <laughs> after, yeah. All right. Number five was pizza toppings. I think we all maybe wrote the same one. I wrote jalapenos. I wrote jalapenos. I wrote jalapenos. Is there anything else? I, yeah. I don't think so. No. If someone can think something, leave it in the chat. Okay, number six was types of candy. I got a jawbreaker. Oh, very good. I wrote Jolly Rancher. Oh, I didn't write anything. Okay. Those are really good answers. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, okay. Number seven. Seven was movie. movie think? Yeah. Oh yeah. Jaws. Oh, I wrote um, Jaws. I wrote Jaws. What? <laughs> like, what else is there? There has. There's another one, but I can't think of any. I don't know. Think I, of I, one. I think there's gotta be so many. Huh? There's gotta be so many that start with J. Another one. Yeah. Uh -huh. Twenty-one. James Bond. Oh yeah. Oh, that's. <laughs> <laughs> and we want to honor Sean Connery's passing. passing. 
Oh, Gino's a good one. Oh, oh yeah. That's, that's really good. Pregnant teen girl, right? That's actually um, uh, a Korean movie first, mm. and then they did a remake of it in, in Hollywood called Juno. Mm. Yeah. Oh, Jumanji. Oh, Jurassic, Jurassic Park. Park. God, you guys, isn't it easy? I think it is easier when you watch oh, yeah. it's actually playing, I right? Kinda, I, uh, yeah, I Those are all like, duh, but it's like, okay. Um, street names. I mean, you could probably see anything, and there's probably a street name yeah. that you know what I mean? I just wrote I John. I thought you were going to say J Street, because there is one of those. I wrote J Street. Oh, okay. It's San Diego. Yeah, okay, J Street. Street. What did you write? I wrote John Street. Like <laughs> a name. You know, those names. People have I know, but names. Here's, a, here's a question. Is there, do you know of a John Street? And if you answer yeah. it, I'll give you the point. Yeah, it's in uh, that one city that's in the United States. It's, <laughs> it's, you know, it's a paved road. And it has a green sign on it, John Street. That's named after my friend John. We're, we're gonna Google that after just to see where that John is. Street. John Street. Yeah. Uh -huh. John Street also sounds like the where? shady place where the Johns hang out. You took it there. I was going nowhere near there, but I, you, I, you, you apparently have yeah, been there. I, I don't know. You're the one who mentioned it, so. Okay. Well, um, here's my answer. I wrote Junipero. <laughs> That's like there's the South County. Um, it's like oh, we're both on it. Uh, yeah. All right. Uh, what was oh, the one? Oh, oh, Junipero uh, Street. There you go. Okay. Uh, I'll, I'll veto myself for right? John Street because that's it was the cop out answer. Okay. Um, <laughs> what was nine again? Uh, things, that you do at a, a things to do at a party. I don't know if it's something to do, but I wrote. Jungle juice. <laughs> that's good enough for me. Oh, oh that's bubble yeah. beach. What? I might like, lose this round. You got two points for that. Jungle oh, juice. Yes. I wrote jello shots. Oh. I wrote joking around. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so innocent. What do, you, what do you do at parties? Joking around? Oh my god. <laughs> okay, fine. Joking around. I'm, I'm a bit. Very innocent person. You do jello shots, you do jungle juice. What? Whatever happened to the jello shots? Innocent party. You know what's funny though, Ed, is in the last week we've done jello shots and uh, jungle juice. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Maybe gosh. a little joking around too. So. Well, your jello shots didn't have any alcohol in them, so it's fine. Okay. <laughs> I'm like. <laughs> I cannot be accused of this. <laughs> Eddie, when, when are you taking PTO and coming down to Orange County? Um, when is uh, James uh, off at work? We can hang out without James because he's being too extra for me right now. <laughs> Just kidding. James, miss you. Oh, feelings got hurt. I'm sorry. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. James, you're, you're the reason I well, want. We're at a party, so I don't know why you're joking around right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, last okay, one. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> well, he, he, Eddie knows how to get it going. All right, number ten was things you bring on a trip. Oh yeah, I wrote Jack Daniels. <laughs> well, you're, you're going on the same trip Lou is going on because he he also said Jack Daniels. Who? I've Jack? never. Oh, I guess who brings Jack Daniels on a trip? Maybe they like to Vegas when you care yeah. about. It. Have you ever done it yourself personally? No, but if you know, it, when I come down to visit, then I will. I'll bring Jack Daniels with me. Can I? But if you bring Jack Daniels, you can just keep it. <laughs> wow. Jack Daniels, you know, like every everyone has that alcohol that they cannot do. I think Jack Daniels uh -huh. is probably like top one or two for me. Yeah, it's because we had what? Jack and Coke that one yeah, day. Yeah, we ruined our experience with that. Don't, at, the, at a New Year's Eve party, that was yeah. yeah. Don't you have an alcohol that you just absolutely cannot do? Tequila. Any tequila. I will like, dry heave at the smell of it. Ew. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just being honest. I can't. That. I want to observe it. I wouldn't mind seeing you dry heave. No, no, it is not. Pretty, you know, college was a rough time. Okay. <laughs> so Tequila, it, I feel like always gets the short end of the stick. 
Yeah, because it's not good. Some people love it. But you saw what happened the last time we had tequila on here, so now I get it too. Was that the one where you cut out like an hour and a half of the live? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was great. <laughs> uh, okay, so I really get a point for that? Say that again? Do I get a point for that? Ooh, or, that's, I mean, that's, I guess that's, so. That's the crowd. The, no, okay. Kemu, get a point for Jack Daniels for things you bring on a trip. <gasps> Did you dress up as milk because your name is Kemu? <laughs> yes, I did. No, I don't know. <laughs> you guys are the ones who pointed out that it was Harvey Milk, too. I yeah, literally had no idea. Him, him being clever. No, so clever. Yeah. Wow, we got five resounding yeses, and I was able to count that within five seconds. That's so weird. I would have been like, Jack on a trip, but I guess people bring. Well, I, th I think all these five people love like, their Jack. Like I, I love, love you all. I love you all. Thank you. I'm gonna lose this round. Kamu Young's wrote, a fan wrote, favorite. Oh no! Oh, we wrote the same thing. We both wrote jackets. <gasps> okay, sounds good. Yeah. All right. Well, let's let's total up this score. I lost. Kamu Young, you have. How many do you have? I have eight. <gasps> wow. wow. World record. Six. Did Mark have a stroke? What's happening? Yeah, wake up. You're going to scare people. I have five. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Jotting notes, joking around, J Street. Yeah, your answers are basic. <laughs> Oh, well, Jello at the hospital. Jello, no, Jello was really good. I I lived for that answer. That was really good. But the rest, mm, meh. Okay. So, what do you have planned this weekend before we let you go? Oh. Um, I think in private we could do yeah, that. Yeah, to indulge that in private okay. outside of the stream. And Neil J says, "OMG, who is that? He looks like James." Hi guys, welcome to our channel. This is the James and Mark Mukbang channel. <laughs> wow, you do it so well. I'm getting confused right now. Yeah. Who is who? Yeah. Look, I have the same, I have a black shirt on. I can go grab a hat. Oh, you are wearing a black shirt. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what well, that just means that there's two handsome people on the stream now. Because you know, or, yeah, Mark, or what? Well, yeah, me and Mark. All right, good night. <laughs> I love having you on. Okay, bye. Oh, <laughs> oh my god! Wow, he just left. You know, okay. we gotta move things along. All right, well, we had so much fun tonight. What you a guys. great Friday! Great Friday. I guess we had a nice break from everything that was going on. We're going to clean and get our weekend going. And like Mark said, we're going to probably do a Korean barbecue video very soon. So we're super excited for that. Have a great weekend. If you guys have not yet subscribed to our stream, hit that subscribe button down below. Give this video a like before you leave. Check out one of our other hundreds. We're up to hundreds of videos. I think we have 400 videos on our channel at this point. Wow. So please binge watch us. It really helps us out. We're trying to get to 20K by the end of the year. So subscribe, love us. We'll see you guys on Monday at 6 p.m. Same place, same time. And like what Chris said, have a good weekend, everybody. Bye. Love you all.